Hi everyone! Hi guys. How's everyone's weekend? Everyone enjoyed the football? Everyone's quiet. What's going on? Hey Lewis, what are you telling me, family? You good first and foremost. So start with you since you went six nil. Hey, how you doing, my friend? I, I, I couldn't be happier. Great weekend for okay. you. Bro. Like uh, my my love for this sport has just been restored. You, you could say the stars aligned for my football club this weekend. You could say it's that. You could say that the stars aligned. You really could say that. Points so dropped left, right, and center, but but not at the bridge. <laughs> not at the bridge. Shout out to Cole Palmer. Shout, shout out to Arsenal. Also, again, thank you very much for the Havertz transfer. We do really appreciate that. Big up to Crystal Palace. Get his name right. Big up to Bournemouth. We did need the two points dropped. That's that's kind of blood clot Havertz, man. Say his name right. Oh, yeah. Arsenal's secret weapon. Yeah, man. Best forward line player in Europe. Best forward lining player in Europe. Don't forget that. Yeah, clinical Kai, bruv. Oh, we we, we, we miss him. Oh, Chelsea miss him. Can can we give you more money, Chelsea, please? Can can we give you more money? Beat Everton, man. Big up Chelsea. Everton. Come on, man. Come on, man. We yeah, did it for you, man. Everton. Merry Christmas, Everton. Hold that. Christmas. I, I want to shout out Arsenal as well. They saw Liverpool collapse and they said you'll never walk alone. We got you. We here. I just want to ask you one question. One question. No, we don't even want to hear from Troop. We don't even want to hear from him yet because it's high. I just want to say something. Can I, just say, I have to say something. <laughs> At the start it's not of the league Arsenal, we go. <laughs> At the start of his Arsenal Aston Villa watch along, I was on the comment right. section. I was telling the Troops TV subscribers, guys, like and subscribe. Big up Troops TV. And he's like, Hussam, I'm going to cook you on back again, blood. I'm going to get some apple crumble, blood. Where's your apple crumble? Where is your apple crumble? Can we spam apples in the chat? Forget 1610. Forget snow bunnies. Spam apples in the chat. Where is your crumble? I, that's all I want to know. That's it. You promised me you'll have apple crumble. Is it because you crumbled as well, Habibi? Where is your apple crumble? <laughs> <laughs> I would have got it, but they don't know what apple crumble is over here. You get me? We eat knafe. We eat different desserts. We yeah, don't yeah. have apple crumble ah, over here. Friends, I would have friends, got friends, it. We have different friends. desserts. Big up all the apple makers in the chat right now. Shout out to all of you guys. guys Hella apples in the chat. That is yeah, insane. Shout out all the apples in the chat. Make, make sure it's green and red apples. Make sure it's yes. both people. Hi yes. ho, hi ho. Drive Down the table you go. Out the Champions League ain't winning no league. Hi ho, hi ho. Hi ho, hi ho, hi ho. Hi ho. It's down the league you go. I was speaking of though, like uh, you did ask for 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 the apple crumble. Uh, troops, if if you could, please, if you could. Share screen, <laughs> you guys. Could. Try find Claret and. Bread. There's your crumble, bro. There's your crumble. There you, you got it. There you are. <laughs> and there you are. <laughs> there you are. There you are. There you are. Hi-ho, well, hi-ho. I hope you should have just left me alone. Hi-ho. I wouldn't have said anything today. I'd have been like my mud brother, all that shit. But I want to cook me. Yalla, let's talk hi-ho. about Starboy Saka. Oh, you best believe the Palmer conversation going to be opened up today, brother. Hi. No, see? no, no, no. no. See? We, we are we, mm. we are not doing this, this scrubby mm. Palmer and Saka argument. Like, we, we are w- dining. We are dining with the likes of Foden, with Bellingham. Real man. Like, we're not doing this whole Bukayo, just at least say all this. No, no, come on. Uh, we, we're moving up in the world, man. We, we are joint top goal scorer. We are, we are one off top assister. We we have already already scored more goals than Havertz ever scored in the Chelsea show in the Premier League. Got more goals than Liverpool in April. We got twenty goals with four big chances missed. We got two hat tricks in a season. Rashford, Saka, Havertz, Nunes, Diaz. They they they're all on zero in general. We're, we're we're eating on a different table. We're eating on a different table. And like it's been real. It's been it's been fun. The whole Saka Palmer thing and everything. But like. Stay on that side. Stay on that side. So we just we just gonna talk about how you know the Arsenal's whole season just ended in four days. We just bypassing that. You know what I'm saying? The oh no! Officially, I'm officially, it could end this not season. yet. We're on wait no, till no, no, Wednesday. No, 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 for no, 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 it's no, it's ended. We just waiting to draw the curtains. The show's over. You know what I'm saying? We just here. There you are. <laughs> we just waiting to draw the curtains. Like I said, 
Everyone told me I was hating, and because Manchester United. I'm gonna wait till Wednesday for that. And as Arsenal this, and I can't lie, I will do it. I'm just waiting for the official. Yeah, I'm waiting till Wednesday for that one. That's still in the balance. Wednesday, I'm with you. Hey, 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 you know what was in the? Well, you know what was in the balance? Then winning the Premier League, and what did I say the entire time, Lewis? Hassan, what did I say the entire time about these lot? That's on them, though. What have I said? What have I said the entire see? Oh, you hating? It's because Manchester United are bad. We got yo. Four things are inevitable in life: death. Taxes, Ryan making an ass of himself in comment section, and Arsenal not winning major trophies. These things all happen, and will all continue to happen. As I've been saying, it happened last season to Arsenal. It's happening this season to Arsenal. They ain't winning no Premier the Arsenal league, train no is about to league. depart. It's always, you know what it is? It's just because they're slightly better. It's slightly later than usual. So normally it used to be like January, February times, and they go out of free competitions in six, seven days. But no, 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 because they're slightly better. It's now April times. It's moved on. That's what it is. Last season, it was April. This season, it was April. But guess what? They will fail. And will always fail. And their fans will continue to drink the Kool-Aid. They're still fans who believe now. A lot of them drink, uh, drink the Kool-Aid. But you know what? Kool-Aid stocks are majorly down. Took a major hit. Kool-Aid shares. You know what I'm saying? It's down about, you know, 17%, 16%, something like that. But we will be there, people. We will be, and I said this. Hey, man, these, these guys really thought that we haven't seen this script before. We it's, the it. it's, it's the same episode. It's the same episode on repeat. It's the same exact thing. You know what it is? It's Jordans. But because you put it in different colours, people think they're different trainers. No, they're still Jordans. It's, it's like John Cena colors. whenever he changes his colour. You got the same five moves. We know it. Come on, man. Five moves We've been here before. Whether he's in bright orange, bright, bright green, whether he's in purple. You're still going to do them two shoulder blocks. You're going to do the little five knuckle shuffle and then you're going to miss the FU. We've been there. We've been here before, and yet the thing is, Arsenal fans still believe, still fully I, drank the Kool Aid. I, I got a ray. It's like Cesaro fans. You man keep believing that he's eventually going to win that world title. It ain't coming. Hey, you have to believe. It ain't happening. You know what I'm saying? It's the Fast and Furious film. That's Shout out Cesaro. He's a gooner as well. It makes sense. <laughs> and I say he lost the to tail hooks like Drew McIntyre. It's all mad. Yeah, Big up, Abdi. Hey, hey, remember the troop saying, "Oh, Villa won't score two. You know what I'm saying? That the Emirates, I got that partially wrong though, because I had Arsenal scoring four. That's what I had. I had Arsenal scoring four goals, and I had Villa scoring two. But what you didn't, make. what you didn't realize is, it's not March. It's not, ain't March. It's not March. And also, you know what Arteta actually realized as well? Kai Havertz is not really good in the forward line, so we thought, let me put him in midfield where he's worse. Hey, it's kind of he, like he did I this weird little been... midfield slash striker roaming thing, but they're yeah. gonna act like that's the reason why they lost. No, 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 no. He had chances. He had chances. The problem is, if it's not a cutback or a header, he's useless. And I wonder who said that. Who said, who that? said that before? And you also spoke about a certain hundred million pound midfielder and, and pressure moments and pressure. Oh moments. yeah, yeah. Your thoughts on is Declan Rice worth the price tag? Is he yeah. worth a hundred million? You know, Lawless, ever Two since things. working with you and Lewis over the last years, I've developed yeah. more and more <laughs> British terminology. I realized that the start of the show, I bust case. <laughs> no one can talk about the <laughs> football anymore. Guys, we suck. We are tuning the league. Moving on to the Arsenal section. Troops, are we going to start the show, brother? You're like, no, cannot we'll wait. Start the show, but I just want to know. You know Let's what I'm saying? It. All the criticism I received Already. about him. Bear in mind, just to clarify, I actually well, think I, I, think I, I believe he's a 90 million pound player, just to clarify. But when pressure... My, my, my 100 million pound midfielder beat Palace at home. You just, you just yeah, but it, again, well, it's not Palace in March or it's not Palace in October. Palace in April is, you know, well, Villa in April, sorry, different is piece. different, I should say. Villa in April is different. I'm saying, but in... Rice's defence, I do have to defend him. I don't fully blame him for not being at the back stick for Bailey and that, because he was still chasing Goretzka from Wednesday. He was still looking around for him. You know what I'm saying? When Goretzka ran off. Also, big up Agent Kai letting the cross in. Goretzka, Jorginho you know. giving the ball away for the second proper Chelsea. Proper. You understood the assignment, my G. Understood, so did Rice. And it wasn't Kimmich who ran off him, or Musiala, or Ganabri. Or it was the LA Fitness Scott McTominay has just called him. You know what I'm saying? What are we doing? <laughs> ran off him. Still looking for him now. So he's still chasing down. You know what I'm saying? Two mistakes in two games. Two critical games. But hey, a hundred million pound player. Flawless don't know what he's talking about and he's just hating. I've been here before, people. I've been here before. I've seen this film before. I've seen this script. 
and I will still buy money for it like it is Fast and Furious. I Facts, man. I'll win. watch that episode again yeah. next year. Yeah, but again, I know they're going to win in the end when they drop Fast and Furious uh, number 10 part two. I'm still going to go cinema. Same with part three, like I did for the other nine parts. And this Arsenal film just keeps getting better and better and better. They keep adding stuff, adding more characters to switch it up. You know what I'm saying? Or add a Kai Havertz, a Declan Blood Clark Rice and Peas to try and switch. Well, we know what the I heard you lot need a left back. Right, you can come shop at Chelsea again. We 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 have a UCL winner for you in that position as well. Well, yeah, people, make sure you hit the like button. Make sure you subscribe. Yeah, yeah, don't yeah. be like Arsenal and Liverpool's forwards. Hit that like button. Hit the, like, hit the yeah. be a Cole Palmer. Don't be a Saka. Hit that like button. Yeah, don't be, a, don't be a Ryan. And he's probably in the chat. I just want 16 out of 10s just because I dislike him that much. Thank you very also, much. Also, Cole Palmer's scored his hat-trick in 16 minutes and 5 seconds. And in maths, we were told to round up. So it's 16-10. <laughs> and, and that being said, before you go, I am trying to get the shop sorted out right now as we speak, people. Merch will be dropping this week. I'm trying to pattern it for you, look. I am. You feel me? All three of us better get shirts, flawless. Of course, come, I've told, told you this. We're all gonna pull up to the pod in that. Come on, of course, you already know that what's understood ain't gonna be spoken about, you know. <laughs> kind of like Arsenal style hopes, but we move. Troops, are you okay, brother? Can you speak? Blink if you are not being kidnapped right now. <laughs> <laughs> You're right, mate. He's having nightmares, man. You know what I'm saying? He's seeing Goretzka run that. Nah, man, he's seeing Goretzka run that. Oh, man, we've all been there. We've I'm all saying. been there. Goretzka ran Lay down, on right? blood clot, Bailey. You understand? <laughs> My brother. <laughs> and he called that. That's the funny My brother really was saying, stand up and rise. Troops Let's called go. That one. Up, man. Troops put that energy out there as well because he said Bailey's going to do something. He called it. He did. He called that one. Yeah, big up Leo Bailey, yeah, man. Charlie on Bailey, man. Shout out, Bailey, man. Proper Chels. Proper oh, Chels. as well, man. I can't remember who he ran off, but it was, yo, man. Shout out to I show speed as well for turning up. <laughs> Ollie Watkins. <laughs> Proper Chels. Proper Chels. Chelsea. 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 Oh man, the, all roads lead back to one place, Stamford Bridge. Hi ho. Hi ho. Hi ho. It's up the league we go. What's going on, people? Troop TV. Back again. Like a blood clot again, you understand? Episode 282 of Arsenal Capitulation. Make sure you like, share, comment, and subscribe to the blood clot thing. You know what I'm saying? Big up the chat. As always, you get me. Big up the mods, them. I see you. Big up these free pussyos alongside me as well, blood. You understand? Uh, we only have one winner this week. You get me? Um, two of us held L's and one of us uh, drew away to piss poor Bournemouth. Yeah. Lewis, fantastic victory from your team. Cole Palmer uh, showing that he deserves to be in the Euros. Same amount of goals as Harlan. Two hat-tricks in a season and one in the first half, blood. You are rightly sitting at the top, blood. This is just good to be up here. This is so good to be up here. And also, Palmer's up there with four big chances missed. Harlan has 30. We do things different over here at Stamford Bridge. But yeah, what a weekend. What a weekend. It's just slightly restored my love for this sport. So Liverpool in the bin. Arsenal in the bin. United dropping points again. I, just when I say that I don't believe that we can get Europe, th these guys just drag me right back into it. They drag me right back into it. And even though I don't think we're going to have the consistency needed, like I doubt the teams around us are going to have the consistency either. So somehow I'm three points off six. Cool. Cool. If we get there, nice. We managed to end the season in a semi-decent way. I'm going to say semi-decent, but what a step forward. Six goals scored. But even forget the six goals. We kept a clean sheet. A clean sheet. I haven't seen that since, like, January. It's ridiculous, but 
it's good to be back. Shout out to the panel. Shout out to the chat. Cole Palmer, Young Player of the Year. Charge is finished. I now want Player of the Year. And yeah, up the Chels. Up the Chels. It's, it's good to be back on top. Flawless. You are there because you scraped a win at uh, draw. Oh, sorry. A draw? Yeah, yeah. Respect at us. Bournemouth. Yeah. Draw. Tough uh, away ground. Like I said, scraped. Yeah. You get me? We did. Yeah, 100%. We scraped. We fought to the bitter end. You know what I'm saying? If, if certain other teams did that, they might still be in a title race. But here we are. <laughs> Carry on. Hey, Declan Rice said it, to be fair. Shout out Declan. Blood clout rice in peace. But sorry, go on. <clears throat> Carry on. My apologies. Yeah, that was your intro. <laughs> Why is that all we get? Because you know what the crazy part is, people. After Saturday, troops had hella chat on Twitter. All oh, flawless in the mud. Jose and Man United got beat. His side tick got his side chick got smashed. Rare to a turn all this. I see that. I laughed. At it. I was like, you prick. And then Sunday come on, come along. Sensational Sunday. Absolutely sensational. I could have wrote that script better if it was me. Arsenal and Liverpool back to back L's at home. I was on cloud 16. Honest, we were just laughing Couldn't believe them, it. Bro. Yeah, we was, but you still have to take a straight. You know what I'm saying? It is what it is. Yeah. But we'll go back to Arsenal. It was just beautiful. After all the chat and energy I've been hearing from content creators, including troops, you know what I'm saying? All these Kool-Aid drinkers, man. These Kool-Aid connoisseurs. That's what I call them. The Kool-Aid <laughs> connoisseurs. And they held two to Villa. After fumbling the bag against Bayern, and you could tell by the way that they lost that the players know it's gone. They finished. That was that Southampton 3-3 free, free flex. They knew. they knew. They knew. Telling you. But yeah, I'm blessed. Big up the chat. Run up the likes, hit the subscribe button. Manchester United managed to get a draw, so we didn't lose. Like I said, and even if we would have lost, I'd still be here with this energy. Because misery loves company. And hey, Arsenal, come and join us. Oh, it's great. You know what I'm saying? And that this is this is miserable settings over here. That's what this is here, people. Miserable settings. But big up troops. Big up for having me on the show. Shout out Lewis. Big up for Sam as well. Man. Who's Actually, Sam? Got a shout out Declan Rice. Oh shit. Yes, Aki. One sec. Real recognizes real. My guy. Proper oh, Chelsea. Oh. Unbelievable, man. Shout out Rice. Shout out Declan Couscous, my guy. Wow. <laughs> Declan Couscous. <laughs> wow. Wow, he went there. Declan, Declan Couscous is pretty. Said Declan, <laughs> Declan Couscous is pretty. <laughs> <laughs> that's a new one I'm using yeah. now, Lewis. Yo, yo that's fun. That is brilliant. Yo, Declan <laughs> Couscous <laughs> is phenomenal, yo. <laughs> oh. Who's um, mm. I said I was gonna pull up with <laughs> Apple Crumble, but instead I pull up with Humble Pie. Mm. Brother Anna, my season ended last week anyway. Halas. We've already gone <laughs> past it. <laughs> we lost to Crystal Palace from Old Trafford. They said season's done, and then we lost to Atalanta. Halas. Yeah, and you cooked me three and lost Atlanta at home. It's way worse than losing to Crystal Palace one then. So we lost. It officially makes us out of the title race and, uh, you know, out of this whole thing. You get me? So I am just now top four merchant. I got top four. I won the energy drink cup. Khalas, my season's done. Now we plan for post club era. So my season's done already. It was done like Thursday. So I, I've had three days. You know how when in the funeral settings you have three days funeral uh you know just uh and stuff three days Khalas, three days is done it's monday we move on look forward to life after club and season's done for me anyway so this is just another game breaking news guys liverpool forwards missed 500 chances again and we <laughs> lost the game oh who's been saying this for the last fucking five months me so anyway yeah we're here <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, so um, it's just you when you say season's done. That's really for all of us, man. Pretty much, it's been a run. <laughs> but I'm just waiting for City to put I me out my misery. Yeah, yeah, like we both, yeah, we both bleak have FA Cup semi finals. Like, all right, we're here, but how long for type of thing? Hey, Chelsea, you must. That's all I'm gonna say, man. You must. You must. Yeah, hey, so like I'm just thinking about today, man. I, hear, I ain't I trying that. to think about tomorrow. 
Yeah, man. You get to those bottles and it's all good, man. Don't worry about it. Troops, <laughs> <laughs> can we just start the section at this point? <laughs> We've got like 48 super chats. We've got to run oh, through this. Be a long... He caught yeah, life. Can we start it first, troops, please? Can we talk about Arsenal first? Just get nah, let's run through the data. Let's run through the super chats, man. Get to the back. Get to the back. It's yes. all right, man. You know why? I'm thinking the sample. I just try to think of more jokes. That's all. Go we'll go on. <laughs> well, so you got to let the super chats cook as well. <laughs> yeah, just they cook. You know what I'm saying? The super chats cook. I'm trying to get more material from them. I'm not going to lie. You know, like, yo, let's go. Let's go. It's... Big up my brother Fats <clears throat> every yeah, damn time. He says it's getting ice cold in here. So it took Palmer to score another hat trick in 16 minutes of five seconds. Just add another, just add five seconds more for celebration. That's 16 minutes and 10 seconds. Bakaya Saka, move aside. We're rounding up just like they told us to do in maths. Hear it. We got Randy Viper, my dog. He says, Carefree Lewis on top. No diddy. We got man like Fats one more time, my G. He says, Lewis, care to start. <coughs> Palmer again, ole ole. Palmer again, ole ole. Palmer again. Palmer again. Father again, ole ole. What a chart, man. I know that was booming around the bridge today. Big up, bro. Big up, Randy Viper, one more time. He said, a fool says what he knows, and a wise man knows what he says. A wise man named Flawless told us to keep drinking the Kool-Aid. We drank. Flawless knew. I knew all along. You know, the crazy part is, yeah, next season, if this happens again... You lot will drink it right back on the roller again, coaster. You, know? you lot will drink it again. And again. And again. Big up Gabriel, my G. He says, where's Ray Ray? Mr. 16 out of 10 is still hiding or dead. He's, nice actually, he's, he's, like, he's alive. Oh, is he I'm here? putting oh, him in intensive yeah. courses. How to stop being an emotional bitch and just be a man and grow up. And he's currently taking lessons. So, yeah. First. Big up my dog, Abdi. He says, Arteta is Poch with an FA Cup. It's a cold world. And then Poch could win the FA Cup this season as well. No, if we match Arteta's seven-year legacy in year one, it's going to be crazy. Especially with that fraud. Madness. If you lot could see what I see, blood. Oh, mate. <laughs> is he in the background? Yeah, blood. <laughs> Bong. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I'm gonna say though, you did this scrolling... to yourself with this one. You did this to hey, yourself, hey, Lewis. You know when you're scrolling down YouTube Shorts and there's a video of like the Pacific Ocean. It's like oh, yep. oh, and there's like a great white shark just jumping, just jumping to like bite off a piece of the ship or something. You don't understand, uh, yourself, You you, you just that. stuck. You just cut yourself and you just stuck your leg in the ocean, and now the sharks are festering. Big up Todd Miller. He says, deflect all you want, Hussam and troops. But today's pod is brought to you by EPL Player of the Year, Cole Palmer. Thank you, Palace and Villa. Up the Chels. I'm going to bring him in in a sec, people. Let me just fly through these, blood. Then I'll bring him in, blood. Pause. Big up Shoe. He says, Lewis, you better fire that stove up for this cooking. Cold Palmer is joint top scorer, even in this team. And that, not just that, he's one off top assister. We're going for everything. We're going for everything in sight. Big up. Big up, Jason. He says, was it Gabriel Jesus and Zinchenko to be blamed? Um definitely um both played a part in the defeat i will say that not don't not all the blame though but we're gonna break that down no diddy big up jack he says i honestly just want to see lewis happy big up we're not even faking these smiles it's not toxic positive bs let's go big up bro big up mohammed he says united or liverpool need a right winger sell them a sacker 
overrated. Yeah, if you're selling Saka at a cut price, I'm here for it, man. I don't yeah, know about man. that, blood. Uh, well, you I need a new to him. Yeah, I man. If, that, that, man. That's what he said. He's overrated. He's overrated. I disagree, yeah. but I'm saying if he's selling him, hey, cut price, I'm with it. Start dog killing my people. <laughs> they got CFC, CFC Bents. He says, moving from left to right, Cole Palmer is dynamite. Da, 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 da. Big up my doggy Rums. Big up he Rums. says troops. Our yard man that. Big up the panel. Big up Rums man every single yeah. time. Big up Rums. Man, I want to play for yard, but you want to play for Villa. Let me just keep, let me just hold my mouth. Big up Jack. He says, big up man, but chances of starting on time equals Arsenal's, Arsenal's chances of trophies equals 0%. You know how it goes, bro. You get me? But you know, sir, the show will go on. And it will be an epic show for the people then. Uh, big up my doggy, Ed. He pulls up with the 1610. That's a real one. He <laughs> says, big up the panel. Troops who saw him. We are the biggest bottle job merchants. Hamza should be here cooking us with Flawless and Lewis. Um, and 16 out of 10 merchant is still here in crickets waiting <laughs> for those <laughs> gal to answer. Big up Mr. Ed every damn blood clot time. Big up man like Teddy. He says, troops, what's it like being a Walad? Big up Hussam. Um, it don't feel good, blood. No diddy. Uh, big up Zap. He says, Palmer is more technically gifted than Salah. Um, yeah, I've got this understanding. sent maximum better than Salah. Move on, yeah. Hey, I didn't even say anything. Go for it. That's fine. Aesthetics is killing my people. We got Yasir. He says Arsenal might need another trip to Dubai. Ha ha ha. Very funny. <laughs> we got Sahil. He says troops will never walk alone, my brother. Flawless. Bring on that super villain laugh. Hey, I don't think hey, it's he super read it villain. this week. Flawless oh. Lewis, he read it this week. You notice he didn't stop and go like Hussam. Read it, read it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because he knows that, you know, the show's over. Like that rap yeah, is like. It's done, man. He knows, man. Troops is a broken man. We all seen. No, it's because yeah, you not... lost, and then Arsenal. Yeah, I've, I've not actually watched the along. video. I've not watched the video. Obviously, I'm subscribed to Troops TV. Long time subscriber, and I have seen the title of his video say, "Our title hopes is over." So yeah, I'm gonna mm -hmm. watch that afterwards. Yeah. So he knows it's done. Big up, man. Like Staffy, my G. Make sure you subscribe to Staffy TV. Big up, Staffy. He says, "Lewis, head of the table." Hashtag acknowledge him. <sighs> my guy. Mr. 16 out of 10 himself. He says, who saw no agendas today. Certain right wingers oh, no. bottling another title race needs calling out. We won't win another game this season. Top four in jeopardy. How far you went, you know, you know, went you know, from your winning the league to and show chess. No, no, no. He no, to we're win not winning league. another game this season. No, no, no. No, no, no. True, um, Lewis, one more. No, he went from Jurgen Klopp's quadruple chasing Reds. Unbearable. To not unbearable. Quadruple chasing Reds, Reds to not win in the league. So man went from hey, four hey, now you're just unbearable. to even fourth place. Oh yeah, he's always unbearable. He went from now you're Arsenal. just unbearable. By he he went he went from Arsenal or a super team and one of the best Premier League sides he's ever seen to it's all over. And then Mister Sixteen out of Ten is back again, and he says, in the crunch games in the end of the season, Mane would be the one to step up. Who saw him actually? He said he played well yesterday. Worst player on the pitch. <clears throat> he said, "Who plays well? on the pitch is mad." I think he means Salah. Oh, he means Salah. Okay, right, right, right. Yeah, right he wasn't much playing on the pitch. Big up Elijah. Big up Elijah. He just dropped that and bounced. We got certified. My G. He says, "Big up the panel." High troops. Is it still King Kai? Uh, big up twenty one in. He says, "Lewis, your mug, your knife, bro. Just corner." Yeah, hold that. 60 million in the bank. Havertz is fucking wank. Savvy, savvy, that. Hey, hey, waka, waka, hey, hey, hold that. We got man like Alex, real G. He says, when it comes to Champions League, Arsenal still got nappies on compared to Bayern, who got European royalty. Big up from Hong Kong, by the hey, way. Shout out to you, man. Big up oh, your God, damn self, crazy. bro. G. Big up Here, but banter aside, I'm not speaking on that Bayern game till it's done. It's got to be fast. <laughs> big up C24 because he Same. said this to me on one of my fan calling shows a couple of weeks ago and even before that. Word to Stephen A. Smith, man. What can go wrong? 
what can go wrong will go wrong. Big up C24 is a real one, OG. He says, Flawless, say it with me. He said it already, the piece of shit. He ain't saying it again. Just wait. <laughs> FC will never. We will we let me. AFC will never let me down when it comes to shitting the bed. It's Christmas Day and my birthday. Big up C24. Happy birthday, C24. I don't think about that. No, I don't think he's saying it's it's very saying it's rolling. Yeah, he's trying to shit, bro. You yeah, it's happiness. Yeah, big definitely. up Roms, my G. He says troops are yard man. That big up the panel. He said it twice, blood. This guy's just trying to fully troll. Big up Jack. He says troops looks as helpless as Drake in the Grazzy. It is Damn. what it is, blood. Big up Elijah. He says I can't wait for Palmer to come to Emirates, Lewis. Yeah, he you can take him at 32 it. years old like we usually do with the Arsenal retirement home. We got 21N again. He says, sourceless, moving like a, it's a, a you-know-what. Having to find enjoyment in the next man's success. Focus on Bournemouth and then, man. Hey, man. Welcome to the Losers Lounge, my friend. Welcome to the <laughs> Misery Loved Company. Welcome to the Losers Lounge. You know what I'm saying? 20 in, I... life is unfair. <laughs> Yeah, Should man, well, Flawless be laughing at me and at troops right now? The honest answer is no. Will he laugh at us? The, the honest answer yeah, is yes. So just that's it. Shapeless, like like you haven't well, seen me here month after month being laughed at. Well, or, hey, ain't no fun when the you should know who Flawless is by this time. <laughs> we got South Charm. I hate watchers. Facts, it ain't no fun when the rabbit's got the gun. It ain't no fun, is it? Oh, we got Big South for my G. He says troops. I'm fuming. This wild cooks us today. The politician fucked our season. Arteta should send his ass to war. I don't want to see him in my team. Damn. Damn. Big up Rayway. Says, Hussam, you you're going to give any credit to Robbo and Gakpo for being the only good outfield players or does it not suit your narrative? Congrats to City, by the way. Uh, Rayre, you were literally watching my earlier on video where I gave credit to Gakpo. I'm not going to give credit to Robertson. He made a goal line clearance. Other than that, he wasn't good. Second of all, you went from congrats Liverpool to congrats Arsenal to congrats City. Make your mind up. Stars are aligned in FC. <laughs> Apologies. Took Sunday off. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Ill from eating crumble. That's good. Big, Big up, up my guy in the line this weekend. Is that? Big up Mr. 16 out of 10. He's going ham today. Big I can't lie, but no diddy. He says, Flawless is such an idiot. Rice has been world class this season. 105 million well spent. And don't diss Fast and Furious, best movies of all time. This is why you're an idiot, because you don't be listening. I didn't diss Fast and Furious. I said, we know what's going to happen at the end, and we still watch. Like Arsenal season, we know what's going to happen at the end. Who the That's fuck calls I mean. Fast and Furious best movie of all time? Your it's taste. The, it's, it's, it's the same, you know. Jim, hey, hey, wait, wait, wait. Ryan, Asam, Ryan. Asam, hear, hear what you just said. You just said, who calls Fast what? and Furious the best film of all time? Who I just named two... 10 movies better than, them, right, than that right but, Listen, listen to what you said, Hassan. Who says Fast and Furious is the best films of all time? Who says on a live stream to two guys? I'll tell you on the answer. 16 out of 10. Come on, like man. 13 year old teenagers who play GTA and drive cars. That's it. Rera, you're it's supposed to be a grown man. Grow up, brother. Supposed to be. <laughs> supposed to be. Big up Southpaw. One more time, my G. He says, Troops, I can't take this cooking. Flawless, you wallad. Your team, Rob Bournemouth and Newcastle, claps your side chick. And Hussam, the quad. Do it for Klopp. I, I just want to say... Hey, I went one out oh. of four. You're going to go zero out of four soon. Yeah. So wait, is it my fault that the Bournemouth attackers can't score? We did everything in our help. To, we did everything in our power to help them. Like, well, yeah. what more could Manchester United do in that game for Bournemouth? We did everything. We got Todd Miller, my G. He just says... Chelsea! 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 We got Robert. He says Isaac is the next Henri. Hands yeah. off Arsenal. Next Henri. The fuck That's do you me. see in this guy? <laughs> he ain't that good. Calm down. <laughs> Big up MF. He says Nketia has scored a hat trick before Saka. Hashtag 14. Hashtag 7. Who did he score the hat trick against, mate? Uh, and Jackson. CFC Ilias. My G, he says, flawless voice, drink the Kool-Aid, blood. You better start adding some lean in that motherfucking bottle. By the way, R. Kelly won as many trophies as Arteta this season. Damn. Big up Max. He says, man did the good evening on Arsenal. Graves, hold that. Big up TC. He 
says, Lewis, it's good to see a smile on your face. This is good to see some good football. It's good we got Yashir, my Gigi. He says, benefits of being from Brom is I done a Hamza today and went to Villa Park to say thank you, Bailey Unai. Also, troops, was Saka's XL expected limps. <laughs> expected limps is jobs. Every time, buddy was limping before, he was limping in the tunnel on the way on the pitch, bro. It's such I actually saw oh, troops on the way. Right, like, I'm, he's I'm, like, I'm, he's I'm, already I'm, limping, I'm, blood. He's already he's, limping. He was limping on the way out. I, I did an Ollie. That's when I turned Ollie out when he did that to Pogba against Rochdale. And he, that's when I turned. I was like, I've had enough. Is that what he did? Crazy. Big up Fats. He says, Who's the special guest? You'll see him anytime soon now, blood. Big up Omar. He says, hi, Flawless. I'm here to see you cook. Big up Lewis. Hey, big hey up, up man. man. He called the fan calling show Barcelona fan. Very, very intelligent. Yeah, football, big up man. Omar Bari, man. Big yeah, up to him. Very intelligent. Big up Brian Lopez. He says, Aston Villa won the Champions League more than Arsenal won the league, unfortunately. And shout out Cold Palmer. He is in form from an Arsenal fan. And hey, Villa got more European hey, heritage as well. The yeah, idea was thinking, where's your, your... My treble winner. Your I actually disagree with that. I don't even think Aston Villa wanted the game in the first half. That's the mad part. Big up Todd Miller. He says, bring up the tweet. Palmer is him. Big up Palmer. I don't know what tweet though. He's talking about the tweet that I tweeted. Big up Kuti Kutiolo. He says, never seen troops so speechless. You should have seen I'm like this every fucking April, mate. So is Havertz. (laughs) (laughs) Big up Sheik TV, my brother. Make sure you subscribe to Sheik TV, blood. He says, big up Flawless, yeah, Hussam, yeah. Lewis, and my G troops. Hope all are well. Season on the line for Arsenal versus Bayern. Ours already done. 16 out of 10 weekend for me. Facts. Cheek. Facts. Big up Andy Q, my GG. He says, Chelsea rock bottom. Everton got faith in you. Lewis beat Arsenal. 3-2, bro. Tomorrow, Champions League, we turn in our ground. Hell on earth. Flares. Dead animal blood. When I fist up PSG, no diddy. Arsenal in the mud troop. Arsenal in the mud troop sucks ass. No, did he? And no way do I do them thing there, dog. Uh, big up Sheik TV every time. Um, he says it's all part of the master plan. Where to Andy Tate? It was all part of the master plan, wasn't it? Love that. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out Andy Tate. Big up Andy Tate. That clip is legendary. Big up African Giant. He says insert Thierry Henry smirk meme. Big up Lewis. I can't do it like that, but yeah, big up. We got Andy Q one more time. He said, drinking Arsenal tears, me, troops. It's oh, definitely dude. me, you, oh. pause. Um, big up Daniel Reese James. It's Chels every time. He says, big up the panel and hold that. The bottle job in red. Palmer is him, young player of the year. And we are coming for the golden boot. I want to re-vote for player of the year. Bring it all back. Big up Oregon Goon, my brother. He says, on the strong stuff tonight, blood. Yeah, blood, trust me, family. Big up Alex, my G. He says, Arsenal got nappies when it comes to Champions League. Bayern are European royalty. Big up from Hong Kong, by the way. I think he said that twice, blood. Big up here. That's crazy. Yo, Hong Kong, that is mad. Shout out up. Hong Kong, blood. Worldwide. Big up Ilya. He says, 16 out of 10. Nah, more like 16 out of 10. Looking ass Liverpool and Liverpool. Liverpool and Arsenal. Big up Ilya. Out of context is in the building. He says, long time. Big up. Except the Hussam. Troops, I will not get onto you. Shit happens. But this fraudism singing, we top of the league. Find yeah. me a clip where I sang we're top of the league. I'll delete my channel right now. I, I literally have a clip of it. Let's see this guy. Big up Southern think... Good on my G, blood. Make sure you subscribe to Southern Good. I've not seen it. He says, people can't... Feel... Sorry, on, sorry. Troops, go on, sorry. Are, you saying, are you saying about the one where we, I was singing we're going to win the league? Yeah. Bro, that's not where top of the league. That's we're gonna win the league. That was when Caicedo was announced. Yeah, yeah, end. yeah. It was from back then. I exactly. could tell. From we ended up with Endo. So you have to like people can't just AI that from. That's why you shouldn't put the same claims. You know how these people work. Sorry, troops. Who is there? He says felt the draft. The SS Arsenal boat just hit an iceberg. We're a revolving door of chaos. Cheers, brethren. Big up your damn self, Broski. Good to see you, blood. You like make sure you subscribe to Southern Guna TV, blood. 
Big up this wild ad blood. Make sure you subscribe to him. <laughs> Big up Jacob, yo. Big up Jacob. <laughs> and that's a proper dad joke as well. I know he's laughing. <laughs> he says, Jamaican me smile today. Blessings to y'all and Bailey. This guy's just a waste, man. He's <laughs> about to have a kid as well. So congratulate him in the chat, guys. Big yeah, up. Man. Congratulations on that. Blood. Congratulations, Jacob, man. You should yeah, name that Big up, brother. You should, change, you should name your child Bakayo. <laughs> and if it's a girl, name her Beth. We got Ray Ray one more time. He's getting mad with it. He says, can't wait for the Sophie and Troops podcast. You're finished, Troopy. I'll be watching with a cigar in my hand. By the way, all four of you. Hey, what there. you need to do, hey, because he because he's got such a crush on Sophie Rose, you need to show her the 16 out of 10 vid on the actual pod. You DM Queen. me begging not to. Nah, please show her. <laughs> and now, now I am. Now, now I you am. are. Let's be going. Yeah, 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 yeah. Show That's her. the closest yeah. you'll ever get to her. Big up Sing is King, my GG, real one. Good to see you, bro. He says, Big up troops and the man, them. It looks like them blue moon bastards could now win another treble. Corrupt Ben Jods. I totally echo them for big bro. up, big up the blue brothers. Big up Winter Surfer, my G. He says, Troops, I feel sorry for you. No, I don't, you wild lad. <laughs> Big up surfer, yo. Well, Big I surfer, surfer. you're an asshole. <laughs> Trust me. Big up Jack one more time. He says, I feel bad for you. This is for your health, troops. Big up. Respect my bro. I'm going to need that blood. Big up. Big up Bab uh, Baby Last. He says, troops, is it Arteta out? Fam, I'm tired of this guy. We're literally going to go straight into that now, blood. Pause. No diddy. Big up Din Sheen. Says Arteta is dreaming for Dubai, but Unai feeding him. No, did he? <laughs> Big up Mohammed. He says, forget Dubai, take him Afghanistan. <laughs> this crazy. Oh my god. Big up Todd Miller. These super chats are 16 out of 10. Facts. Up the Chels. Up the Chels. Mr. 16 out of 10. Back again, blood. He's moving sick with it. Like I said before, blood. Big up Mr. 16 out of 10. He says, Hussam, you are such a fraud. Robbo was very good. Looking good going forward and was sold solid defensively. Shame other players don't follow his example. We got Eli, my GG. He Eli, says, Cole Palmer done. is him. Troops, Arteta fucked us again. No, did he? He definitely did, blood. Big up D. Riley. He says, uh, Arsenal sold... Be but oh but. Arsenal Arsenal sold but Odegaard is him. Odegaard is a real one blood. Feel yep. sorry for him. Yeah, played well. Big up Hussein. He says is Van Dijk still the best Premier League defender of all time? Big up you guys, bro. I don't know who the fuck said this because it wasn't me. Yeah, that's you're so lucky. Ball. Robertson cleared that off the line though. Yeah. Big up baby last one more time. He says time for Arteta to bounce. His tactical arrogance is killing us. Man said Trossard started over Martinelli because he is the manager. Well, he's not wrong. He is the manager. That's true. We got yeah, we got one more time. He says Rance and I both knew Arsenal are losing when we saw troops unpack the Arsenal prime bottles. I seen you. It's mad they dropped that twice at the same time this season. Like they're doing it on purpose. Yeah, man. I seen oh. you unpacking, man. You get the what's it called? I love that, man. Get the the Brian brand deals. Boxing. Love that, man. Nah, for real. We got C Flair. He says, Lewis. up the Charles, we're going for Golden Boot. Charles. Oh, Troop said it. <laughs> Arsenal tears are my favourite. Let's go. Well, we got him. Chelsea, Chelsea. We got Jason. He says, I some Liverpool players turning on Klopp for a sad ending. Shout out to Flawless. Stop giving them out and out their fucking shit. <laughs> Shout out Kosovo Baller, my G. He says, 16 out of 10, Snow Bunny, Apples and many more. What a season. Mm-hmm. And big up Benjamin. He says, big up guys, season done for my team at Liverpool. Was done from Thursday. Oh, mate. <laughs> bong. Bong. Mm. Bong. Mm. Ah, this midfield three is going to be peak, bro. Look who's in the building. Is, that, is wait, it Casemiro, Cruz, and Modric? Let's Wait, is, is that Hamza run there? Big up Hamza as well. Is that you on the yeah, video? Hamza, yeah, yeah, yeah. AI is amazing, oh, man. Yeah, it's amazing. Hey, hey, someone, I need one. Hey, one of you lot, I need one of me. I'm sorry. You know what I'm saying? I, I need me on that. Actually, can I, can I have one too? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Whoever, can I have one as well? <laughs> someone That's it. That, Please. Is someone Photoshop Ray Ray in the crowd as well? 
<laughs> I'll play the music. There's a loop. Big up, Panzer, yeah, bruv. From the start. Yes! <laughs> AI is unbelievable, man. Boom. That's why I Boom. Boom. <coughs> mm-hmm. Look at the Arsenal yeah. fans. Yeah. Yeah. You're right, Hamza. Congratulations yes. on the weekend, my friend. I'm very happy for you. Listen, I'm so happy. I'm looking at both... both. Bottle jobs there. Both also, bottle thank you for Palmer there. again. Thank yeah, you. I don't know who to start with. I don't we'll know. Start who to with start Arsenal. With. Can you do well, that? Where, well, where where we're starting is at the Emirates, isn't it? Mm. I, I listen. Troops, I've been telling you for a long time. Troops, you know both for a long time. You've been watching a football club for a long time. Yeah, you know one one thing that's associated with a football club. Bottle jobs, facts, bottle jobs, <clears throat> whether you like it or not, you've bottled it many times before Ateta, before Emery, during Wenger era, you bottled it. We knew it. You can't sustain pressure. We've seen your greatest players bottled it. And I'll give you an example. I'll give you an example, 100%. We remember, yeah, we remember when you had two games to go to win the league with the Henri, Vieira, Petit, yeah, I told you, we don't forget that, Wednesday you played Leeds, you beat Leeds, you beat Everton, you were, you're Premier League champions, two games to go, your players bottled it, United won the title, you bottled it in the FA Cup. Penalty from Berkham, bottled it against 10 man United, gave them the treble. That season, you bottled your Wednesday, bottled the FA Cup, you gave them the treble. How many times have you bottled it? We know your bottle jobs. You've bottled Europa League against Galatasaray. What a joke. You bottled the Europa League. Who bottles Europa League finals, man? Like literally against Galatasaray. Did someone say Europa League final? Bro, they bought the Europa League final, bro, against Galatasaray, a team that season. Oh, so they got Luis, previous. See, Luis, that season, 98, when they had Bergkamp, Suka, Kanu, Henri, Vieira, Petit. Here's me thinking Adam, Opera and Ozil was bad enough. With them, no, man. Wow, crazy. No, Luis, that season, you dunked Galatasaray 5-0. You send them to Europa League. Hi, right. you send them Europa League. Hi, Chelsea and before the money, in it. That's just mm. it. And Chelsea, Chelsea, actually, actually, actually talking about the story, by the way. Yeah, he's right. <clears throat> Nihat yeah. Kahvechi, do your research. Some they they bottled a Copenhagen final. This is there's a documentary done about this. Galatasaray had to do a documentary on Netflix. It's available. Go and watch it. They talk about how they knew they're gonna win it because they were playing Arsenal. Uh, how did look, look at you? I went, I went to Istanbul. I met a guy. I swear to God, a taxi driver. He said, where are you from, England? Oh, yeah, I'm a Galatasaray. Oh, yeah, we won the Europa League final against Arsenal. I'm thinking, yeah, that's obviously you're going to win it because they're bought jobs. Yeah? How many years? 20 years you've been waiting for league titles, troops. 20 years, troops. I feel sorry for you. I feel Why sorry you for you. Why did you stop There's another La example you mentioned. Yeah, Champions League. Why are you sucking off this guy? No, did he? Look at you. Drink your <coughs> no, dead tea. No, because I brought Hamza to be reserved. Drink your dead Hamza tea, blood. Fine. You brought Hamza here. You probably put you milk in your tea. Oh, so you, you want to bring up the 0 1 FA Cup final, dumb. don't you? Is this guy dumb, blood? No, oh, no. I want him to cook. Let's talk about same. Liverpool bottling the FA Cup with your dead but white suits, you blood. Do you want to go back in the day and talk about that? Hamza is scared to mention Thierry Henry in front of troops. Champions League final. Your greatest player bottled it. It's true. Your greatest player. The one that you got a statue. Shout <laughs> out Timo Henry. Bro, bro, I'm thinking, have some shame, man. This guy failed in the Champions League final one on ones, one on ones, and then had the audacity to blame. They asked him, How you've lost today against Barcelona? He goes, Where's on? Where's Ronaldinho? Where's Eto? My guy was so salty. Rather than be like Drogba, Drogba lost the Champions League final and said, yo, I'm staying at Chelsea. I'm going to give Chelsea a Champions League. Luis, I ain't leaving. My guy said, yo, 
He gave an interview. He said, "Yeah, I'm chipping to Pep Guardiola's team. I want the Champions League. This guy bought jobs. Your legends left you because you bought jobs. <laughs> your legends left you." And no, Henri got- has one final goal in his entire career. That's what I'm talking about. How many of them? I don't think it was at Arsenal. Bro, do you remember when Galas had to sit on the pitch <laughs> against Birmingham City? I thought, yo, bro, you, you're a meme Arsenal football club. You sat on the pitch 90 minutes. My guy refused to leave the pitch. Andre, when I had to come and get him, I said, yo, boy, the grassmen have to water the pitch, boy. People are gone. Don't forget and the Invincibles like, getting knocked out of two cups in four days. The football club. Yeah. And then you brought this manager. Shout out Wayne Bridge. You brought this manager, I've always told troops, a manager who Charles. has no legacy as a player, a Spanish player, backup player that never played for Barcelona, played for Rangers with Ali McCoist, plays with Anne Smith, Tim Cahill. The only reason you signed for your football club is because United thumped you. 8 2. 8 2. My guy signed up as a panic buy, last panic buy. My guy, bro, Tim Cahill was the best player for Everton. Not him. My guy didn't do anything for Everton. A Spanish player, never played for his country. Tried to change his passport to England, to, to play for England. I'll never forget it. It was everywhere. He wants to play for England. I thought, what a shame. Because he never picked for Spain. That's your manager now. No legacy as a player. <laughs> My guy's to play Everton. That's why his references come You need come a from. legacy as a player to be a good manager. Bro, but that's, that's your DNA, bro. You're twerking for a guy, not legacy. I ain't twerking. Not, no, no, I know your fan base. No, he hasn't done anything. Oh, you can't be a teta out. If you're a teta out, you, you, you're you a seller. That's the level of your fan base are. Because they don't have the winning mentality. Do you think any other team, look at, look at United. They want Ten Hag out, bro. They're forcing Ten Hag out. A lot of your fan base, if you're yeah, but we're not that United, like, we're competing. Up. United are not competing. We, we United, are competing United at the highest they, level in the Ole Champions was League, compete, when Ole in was the Premier competing. League. United when, United are getting dunked on by fucking Dominic Solanke, blood. But when United was comp- competing with Ole, they wanted Ole out. They wanted Ole out. When they were competing with Mourinho, they wanted Mourinho out. That's United. Because they the are gap wasn't as close as it is with us to you that see? it was with Ole and Mourinho to United to, to see. But to you, see, for you, it's a gap. It's We're forcing Ole. you to go on these crazy runs. You didn't go on them crazy runs when you was competing with Ole and Mourinho. It doesn't matter. It's not about com- how how close you're competing. It's all about trophies, bro. It's about trophies. This is why your your fan base have a low class mentality. I'm thinking the levels that you your fan base will praise when and it's Wenger's fault. When Wenger said top four is a trophy, you guys took it personally. You don't believe. You've not... I don't think top four is a trophy. I don't, I don't believe top four is a trophy. A lot of your fan base will celebrate coming second this season. They will not call out Teta out. That's failure. Yeah, a lot I'm of not going to call out... I'm not going to say I'll Teta out, but it is failure. But hold on. My guy spent money. My guy spent 700 million. You told us before this season, you said Rob Holding was the reason why you didn't win the league. Now it seems Rob Holding is William Saliba, is it? So William Saliba is playing when pressure's on. William Saliba is playing like Rob Holding, is he? I didn't blame it on Rob Holding. There was a lot of like issues last year. <clears throat> Zinchenko like is a main issue. Zinchenko cost us more than Rob Holding blood. The only issue was going to Man City with Rob Holding. The issue was Zinchenko. Zinchenko cost Man at Anfield. That's what cost us a title. Uh, not look, losing no, that If you had Saliba, you'd have won the league last season. Yeah, exactly. You I actually believe you had Saliba, okay. you won the league. You know, I think, we, I think you know, it was more the excuse you know given at the Holden, time. You know Rob Holden played in the Anfield game as well. No, no, yeah. but that's what I'm saying. Had Saliba been fit at the end of the season, by the way, I'm not We would have won the league. Yeah, and you agree with me as well? Yeah, we would have won the league if Saliba stayed fit last season. And no, that's 100%. No, no, I don't believe yes. that. Yes. Well, that's well, that, that, that. you were buckled under pressure. We wouldn't have buckled under pressure because we were flipping clear with Saliba in the team. This is a problem. You can't you can't say we're gonna buckle under pressure when he wasn't there. Bro, you can't. Bad bro. Point. I'm s i am I can see it. You can't. You can't come I here and no 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 no. You can't come here and say that. You can't come here and say that he, we, we would have buckled under pressure if he was there. You don't know. We I was know. on fire when he was there. No one could break us down, no did he when but he same, was in that same back as this season. 
As, apparently, same as this season. He hasn't City. cost us the title. Saliba hasn't That's cost us the title, bro. You do actually, you do actually look at troops, not in particular that game, but overall looking at it right. If you fall short, who are you pinpointing player wise? Yeah, we can't say Zinchenko either. What, player wise, what, Zinchenko, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Take the manager out. Right. Right. No, no, add the manager into it as well because like yeah, it's the got manager, the manager it impacts each other. The the all, right, all right, let me cook. The manager yeah, has go, a go. part to play because he's the that. one that decides what squad goes out yeah, and attacks yeah. this league title, attacks this Champions League. He's the one in January that that didn't push. Going out and getting a world class striker, blood, or going out and getting a striker, an out and out striker that's capable of getting goals when you need goals, blood. Yeah, it's all fun and games. It's all rosy, ring a ring a rosy in a fucking garden when when you're licking off five nil, six nil. Everybody's playing a part. When it's nil nil and you need, you have that chance that drops. It has to drop to someone who is capable of taking that chance, blood. We, we understand. Tony. We, I said, I said, go out in the market and get a striker, blood. Do you understand? So, excuse you me, got a striker. Arteta, so Arteta has a has, has a part to play, yeah. Edu and Emmanuel have, have a have a part to play because they chose to go out. They chose to go out and get Havertz instead of getting a proper striker, yeah. So, Edu has a part to play. Yeah, the players I have a part to, The players have a part to play as well. <laughs> as well, you understand? Who? They, they, Zinchenko. Gabriel J. Gabriel game? Jesus, yeah, <clears throat> him, him especially, bro, because the amount of chances he's getting in a six yard box and even getting a fucking target, blood. Do you understand? He has mm -hmm. been yep. instilled. He's the one that Arteta said, "Yeah, we're gonna run. You're gonna, I mean, you're you're my main guy." Duh, 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 duh. The guy fell off. He, I mean, Havertz crept in, blood. You understand? I don't blame people like Saliba, Gabriel, Ben White, fucking Rice, flipping Odegaard. You understand? I don't blame them. Even Saka. Saka's, wow. Saka hasn't been rapping. I think Odegaard was your only good player yesterday. No, I'm saying First, like, uh, for losing us the season. This is overall, though. You're talking overall. overall. It's, oh, it's overall. not like, okay. oh, this man, that man, that man, that man. It's a couple I'd, of them, blood. You get I'd, me? It's everyone. If it's overall, it, then it's everyone. Simple as. It's, it's, and it's, it's not but, that. No, because even then only, you could isolate individuals. I yeah, tell you what. It's literally, you understand? There's a couple of them, blood. It's not the majority. I'm like, cool, you understand? But like the people that I'm talking about are the ones that I'm saying that we need. Like Jesus, for example, I've been saying he should be our backup. He should be on the bench, blood. He should be coming off the bench and we should have a proper striker ahead of him. Zinchenko, I've been saying, sell that fucking crybaby from Anfield last year, blood. Am I lying, flawless? If I'm lying, I'm dying, blood. Well, yeah? you've been on the case where yeah, you said I've been Zinchenko. saying sell that fraud from time, blood. Yeah. So me, everything that I've said is the is the people that I've been pointing out. They're the ones. They're the one that's gonna cost us blood, and they're the ones that have cost us blood. Do you understand? But the thing is, troops, you can't complain about that because I'm seeing. Why can't I complain about that? I, I, I'm I'm seeing Liverpool. Are you mad? Or, I, why can't I, I complain Liverpool, about that? I see Liverpool playing with corner Bradley. Is this guy all right? Why, why can't I complain about and that? And my guys are still chasing for the league. You can't complain about falling short. That's crazy. Yeah. No, no, one second. That's crazy. You know, you know what I'm saying? Is Liverpool I don't... Are playing with Kwanzaa. Liverpool are playing Kwanzaa. Gomez. I hear you, Hamza. Bradley, what did they win, though? Van Dijk. Hamza, what did they win? No, no, but that's Hamza's point. Point. By the way, flawless, you understood yeah. it in reverse. And, and he's also, saying Liverpool's depth is one mistake. And we're still in Arsenal position, basically. Oh, right. Okay. But yeah, so that's both both so he's saying with Bradley, even yeah, like even then you both you both but you aren't top because if that's that's, that's his that's... point, Lewis. Your guys are understanding it in reverse. He's saying oh, okay. Liverpool have the children and yeah. they're in the same position. And as Gomez Arsenal. is and Van Dijk's holding these guys. Van Dijk yeah, is holding I, them. I, I, I hear that. Like, holding these guys. I with hear lack that. of experience. Simicas. But, but that's all semantics because they both not good enough to get to where they want to. That's my overall point. We don't have to decipher this. The reason why Liverpool and Arsenal have fallen short is because their squads and teams are not good enough. Yes. That's why. What I've been saying all season long in regards to these two. I said at the start that's of the season. I said that we're not winning the league. I'm, I'm not these men that was saying, yeah, we're going to win the league. Duh, duh, duh. Yeah. I never, I, I kicked back, bro. You understand? I've, 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 I kept saying that our best chance at a trophy is Champions League. You said, said the league, we're winning the league. Yeah. I said, we're winning the league. I said, I said, yeah, you said, you I, said, Champions said league. I said, I said, I said, I said, and I said, if we, Get Madrid if we if we to, if we're to beat uh, Bayern and get Madrid, it's done. And I also said that you understand because I know my level. You understand? I know what I have. I know what I'm bringing to war. Yeah, but you, you said if me. you get City, you're winning it. That's what. Yeah, I, I believe that because I because I believe that we could beat City at home. 
So if you get City in the UCL, you're winning the UCL. That's basically what you're saying. I said we're getting to the final. You did say that. Yeah, yeah. Atletico. Atletico, if they get them in the final, that'd be a tough game. That's tough because low block, Simeone defensively, Jesus Christ, you understand? That That is the real defensive coach, blood. you understand? Prop up. And you can just imagine like Griezmann and like someone like that just doing what Ollie Watkins and Bailey did, basically. Like, that's same, you know, it's kind of... A that's why I say City because City ain't... City don't have that... That pace on the break, blood, where they can catch us. You get me? We, we, they can't catch man on the break, bro. You catch City on the break. City are in trouble, blood. You get me? Bayern Munich, pace is what hurt us, blood. You understand? Aston Villa, yet again, it's the pace that is hurting us, blood. You understand? You look at that second goal. Nobody can run back, bro. It's Smith Rowe that's running back, blood. No one can get back in time. You understand? I know they're high up, but you still have to use your... Why is your junior, why is your junior trying to play the ball there? It's a simple pass right there, and then we can move it to the move it to the wing and try and put the ball in the box. You want to fucking try to force the ball, blood. You understand? You look at the first... You look at the first goal, Zinchenko. He plays them all on side. He fucking... The, 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 um, the Tillemans incident, the match had a nutmeg him on the edge of our box. Is this guy all right, blood? Is this guy all right? That's crazy. Then that's on the ball, he's on the right back position. Yeah, that's crazy. He's not yeah, even yeah, yeah. in his position, bro. Yeah. He's on the yeah. right back. Declan Rice is there, bro. But even Rice, if you're there, then you need to be scanning. But who, who's supposed to be man marking the goal scorer? It's not a man mark thing. He runs in. But you who's understand? supposed to be there? If who, you look at the goal, team? Bailey goes wide and then goes in. No one's there because everyone's so, ball watching. Yeah, Zinchenko yeah. Zinchenko's in like Zinchenko a centre back, right back position. Zinchenko should be there, but he's fucking he's he's fucking on the right hand side. Yeah, why, why is he on the right there? Why are you there? Why are you there, bro? Why have you gone from left to right, blood? Do you understand? All Rice needs to do is have a look and he sees Bailey's run. The goal yeah. don't happen. Yeah, it's true. It's true. But but it's it's a fact that a lot of and it's Arsenal. small margins what has cost us. Mm. You look at the Bayern Munich game. If Rea don't come out of goal, that goal don't happen. Because Gabriel passes back to him. And we just do play out the back, bam, we're, we're on the attack again. It's small margins, blood. You understand? That we have to clean up on. You get me? So that's why I'm saying it's not. The majority of the squad is cool. The majority, well, 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 let me, let, well no. The majority of the starting 11 is cool. We just yeah, need a couple. You get me? Timber's going to go back in. So Zizekko's going to fuck off. Alhamdulillah. You understand? So there, there's one that that agent's gone. You get me? We know that we're going to go out and get a striker. So Jesus is going to hold bench. You get me? Havertz is going to hold bench as well. You get me? All we need to do is go out and get a replacement for Partey. Because if you have a Rice, Odegaard and another proper midfielder there, we're good. We're good. You understand? The defence is fine. Ben White, he's been fantastic the whole season. Arguably the best right back this season. You get me? Saliba and Gabriel, fantastic partnership. You put Timber there, boom. Raya, Raya's improved. You understand? He just, you get me? That one little error. It wasn't even really an error because Raya is, Raya's got a part to play, but that goal could could have still been prevented. Kirill's falling on his fucking ass like a donkey. You get me? It, 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 fucking Rice don't see Goretzka running. It's, mm -hmm. it's, 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 it's basics. Mm -hmm. Look yeah, around Rice. you, bro. Know, yeah. know your positioning on the pitch. Know that, yo, you don't let him run off me. You understand? So it's, you get me, it's, I'm not, I understand, I, I'm, I, I'm, I'm fuming, I, but I'm not at the point where I'm going to be, yeah. oh, fuck, fuck this, oh, we need to, the whole squad have to go, oh, the Arteta out, all this, did it. nah, because this is the thing now, I say Arteta out, who the fuck are we bringing in? The only people that I think are capable, we can't, we're, not, we're not going to go and get, i.e. a Diego Simeone, a Zinedine Zidane, we're not going to go and get these men, I ain't trying to get no fucking Deserbi, or these fucking man blood, people are saying Thiago Mata, I don't not. watch Bologna, I don't watch I don't watch Bologna, so I'm not gonna sit here and say yeah, bring Thiago Mata because I know he's a good player. Now nah, fuck that. I need to know. You understand? I'm not bringing in Potter and these man. He's man mad. But yeah, Gareth Southgate. No I hear way. What you're saying man. with that, but I think it's now, my manager might be up for the for sale it's, in it's summer. Troops, it's not on you. It's on the people. It's on the hierarchy. No, it's, it's on the hierarchy of Arsenal to go and get better. If I tell because your squad. I'm trying. Why are we not playing? Why are we not playing? Martinelli. Martinelli this season, poor stinker. He's one of the worst. 
for your for your team, Martinelli. Hey, big man, you got Doku on your wing, yeah. Behave yourself, blood. Don't forget you got no, Doku on your wing, bro. Yeah? One of the you got Doku on your wing, bro. Yeah. League. Man scores a goal against Luton. You're tweeting fucking don't, baby Ronaldinho. Don't, don't That's some fucking shame, blood. Don't, don't, yeah. That's yeah, some Doku's shame, blood. Than, yeah. Remember Doku's who you got on your wing, bro. How much you spent on fucking Doku, blood. How much you spent on Doku? How much you spent on Martinelli, blood? How much you spent on Doku? How much you spent on Doku? How much you spent? Has Doku been levels? Has Doku been levels? Doku's been dog shit, bro. Doku's been dog shit, bro. What's Martinelli What's Doku done? done? What's Doku done? Goals. What's Doku done? What's Doku done? done? What's Doku done, bro? Tell me. Tell me. Tell me, what, tell me what Beetlejuice has done. Tell me what Beetlejuice has done. It feels like an upper class mid off. Tell me, bro. Listen, tell me what Beetlejuice listen, has done, bro. killed this season. He, he made me. five assists in one game. Tell can't me. say he mid off because of where we're at. He's been assisting many players. Doku is on Anthony levels, blood. Have some shame. Doku is on Anthony levels, blood. Yeah? That guy's a bum. Yeah? That guy's a bum. Yeah? Pep's looking for Gordon, a Gordon Pep's has had a better season out, than Martinelli. Pep's, Pep's Gordon, for Anthony out, Gordon has had a better season than Martinelli. Fact. Anthony Gordon is not shit, Anthony bro. Gordon Anthony Gordon has had a better season than Jack Grealish. Sh hold no, that, blood. No. Anthony Grealish, hold that. What's Grealish on this season, bro? Don't what what, 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 what blood? What blood? Jack, listen, Jack Grealish. Let's not move like let, let's let's not move like your wingers have you been on crud this season, bro. Yeah, because they ain't. Yeah, they ain't blood. Yeah, Doku ain't done. Fuck all blood. Yeah, you want to tweet about baby Ronaldinho dunking on Luton blood? Have some shame, blood. Yeah, listen, have some shame, blood. Yeah. Hamza, you're listen. cooking the wrong part of the wing. Listen, Saka, it's another Saka guy. I want to go. I believe he's missed the goal. This Ask guy, look, there we go. Villa. Saka, go, go, I've been saying, I've been saying for many years, Boto job became. Boto job is another he's another hurricane. okay let me just shut you right he's down now Joe. go go shut your but mouth because you're chatting shit PR. you're chatting 100%. shit blood you're chatting shit you're chatting 100%. shit you're chatting shit for views blood okay. now it blood talk facts blood this is back again blood, talk facts, facts, blood. Yeah. go before. check bakao saka's stats in big games you clown blood yeah in go check games? his stats bro go check his goals and assists Bruce before you chat so shit happy. blood yeah, so go go, go and bit. check his goals Nancy. and assists before you chat shit blood yeah he already dunked on your team blood yeah so allow that blood yeah, he only really dunked on your team. Saka he dunked on all good. of your teams He's on this podcast, blood. He, he dunked on every single one of you, blood. Every single one of you. He, he, every single one of you. he has dunked on blood. Ooh, I scored the penalty against Chelsea. Yeah. He has dunked on all of you, blood. Penalty yeah? merchant. He dunked on certain of you, man, on your own ground, blood. Yeah. So let's not do that, blood. Yeah? He's not. He's not. He's not scored against City. Let's not do that, blood. Let's not do that. Let's not do that. Let's not do that, blood. Certain man, he's dunked on your own ground, blood. Certain of you lot, he's dunked on you on your own ground, blood. Yeah, I when you come Emirates, yeah. he dunks on you, bro. Consistently, blood. Please do yeah. not try that, blood. I do team. not try that, blood. No, Go and check his that guy ain't right. no penalty merchant. Go and get the numbers. Foden scored a hat trick and dunked on Aston Villa. Don't tell Foden's me, blood. Don't, about don't, don't tell me, blood. Beating teams. All he does, he's cool, bro. He dives. He dives. Don't tell me, blood. It took Foden six years to get into the conversation, blood. Saka's been in the conversation for me. For me, touch road, blood. Yeah, from Saka, touch road. Saka's in the conversation, blood. It took it took Foden six years. Yeah, to get out of the brain shadow, blood. Yeah, don't tell me nothing, blood. Yeah, Damn. Saka been carrying this thing, bro. One season, Saka fell off, blood, Saka and he's still got thirty SG. numbers, bro. Yes, still got, and, and his place is still certified in game, the England yeah. team, bro. Yeah, it's Foden gonna start in the Euros, blood. I know Bakayo is blood. I know Bakayo is, bro. Bakayo. Right wing, blood. Bakayo's I know Bakayo, Bakayo is, blood. I know Bakayo is, blood. I haven't, so I haven't seen that limp yet. Can you do that limp oh. again? You see, the thing is, yeah, you this understand? guy. When when going gets tough, you see this guy, yeah. Listen, you see this guy. Yo, you know when you're injured, yeah? You do this, yeah? You see, when you got this. Bro, everyone knows that. My guy is like... Straight out of football. <laughs> you're on thinking, bro. Why? I said the sack of step. Bro. Do that again. How is that what he's doing? 94th minute. 94th, listen, 94th minute, full-time whistle. Check out Saka if he's losing. Yo, my guy is there. Yo, camera, where is he? At the back here. Yeah. yeah, there you are. My guy. Why does everyone watch Saka though? Why does bro, everyone? Why is why, it, why, Saka why does Saka have all this, this hate? Problem? I want to know. know. Every game. I want to know. I want to know. Why does Saka have all this hate? Why is it always all oh, Saka? I don't know why. Because he's the face of your. Because he's oh, the face of your club. Oh, oh Saka. Oh. everyone compares. He's the face of Arsenal troops. Oh, he's the face of your club. Oh, That's oh, why. Oh, what's Saka doing? You compared him to Mo Salah. You compared him to Vinicius. You compared him to Foden. He's they were, they were comparing him to Hazard. Palmer this season has been better than Saka. Arsenal fans. Palmer this season has been better than Saka. Please, Palmer. not me, Please, blood. Saka. Yeah, not you, not you. Arsenal's a fan base. Not me, blood. Yeah, I look. Last season, I've seen the Saka Hazard comparisons. Yeah, like, oh, we were a couple goals away I from matching his DNA in his highest season, and then he got two. 
Brother, let me tell you something. You see, like, you see, like, these, these are gal youths, blood. They get me in this bullshit, blood. Yeah? <laughs> With their stupid takes, blood. Yeah? Big them up, blood. But their stupid takes, bro. And that other... You see, a gal. A gal's my dog still. But your dumb takes, blood, get me in this shit, bro. That other dumb you on TikTok, blood, crying and shit. Yeah? These, no. them, man, they, they get me into this fucking shit, bro. Yeah? I be here spitting the truth, blood. Yeah? And these men be chatting shit, blood. Yeah? Now... Now well, fuck you, I'm, the one, oh, yeah. I'm the one that's getting oh. it, blood. Yeah? yeah. No diddy. Me. Fuck I shouldn't be getting it, bro. I was just I was just gonna say it's, it was your mention the guy who cries. That's you Darude, got one right? Ray Ray. I've got like yeah. ten in my fucking fan base. Yeah, 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 yeah. It was, it was yeah, Darude, did, he, did, he, did he cry? Did he cry when they lost the villa? What did he do? No, it was last season. Bro, no, I'm saying as he cried. No, no, it was when they lost the villa at, away. That was I'm saying as he cried, like, did he do anything this weekend? Just got it. Yeah, cried yet, blood, but you know, say it's too land. Oh, yeah, yeah, soon, land. Because I remember when I was on a pod with him and he told me I was hating and Arsenal were going to win it all. And, all right, Ben. Mm. I just, I just want to know how that's going for him. I can't, I can't lie to you guys. Listen, let's just say it as it is. Now that Hamza's cooked, you get me. By the way, cheeky plug. We moved a from today to tomorrow. So, Igal is going to get cooked on this football. Like and subscribe. Second of all, when it comes to this title, let's just cut the crap. City is winning the league. I'm, I'm just, f fuck all this playing games. Fuck all this shit. I'm supposed to, me and, guys. Me and Happy for you, Hamza. Happy team. for you. One second, Lewis. Hussam was never winning the league, blood. Let me, let, let me just say one thing, please. Me and Troops are supposed to rely on the team that lost 4-0 to Newcastle. Yep, that's who we're supposed to rely on. Guys, you know who's going to stop hey, City hey, from hey, losing the league? West Ham. Wolves. Ooh, scary. Brighton. Oh, shit. City are going to lose five of the last six games. Bro, people need to stop living in, 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 in dream world. And I know even troops might even cook me in the Liverpool section, but I'm going to just say this before we even get there. Guys, I would say this to, to people genuinely in the chat, just, just to be somewhat, just as a bit of advice. In life, you have to be a leader, not a follower. Don't be a sheep. Meh, meh, that's all you do. Follow whichever is the thing. Because what happens now, let me tell you what happens now on Arsenal YouTube, which is the same shit that's happening on Liverpool YouTube. Talk about All it. the people who were waffling the whole year, Arsenal are going to win the league. Liverpool are going to win the league. All the shit. They just st start saying the same shit. Me and troops, which I will give him credit, have been saying this all year long. So now they start tightening their videos, the same shit that we're saying, basically. That's it. That's all the only thing. Stop living in cuckoo land. And also, I will take this a step further. Yaakhi, let us assume me and troops' prayers are answered. And Manchester City, I'm not even going to say lose one game. Let's assume, Yaakhi, they lose two games. Can you guarantee me that Arsenal and Liverpool both win every single game from the end to from now to the end of the season? The answer is no. We cannot guarantee this happens. For the same shit that we always say. With Arsenal, they need to they, uh, with the loss against Aston Villa. I think the second goal you can excuse. I'll tell you why. Because Arsenal are throwing the kitchen sink, they're chasing the game, blah blah blah. The first goal, though, I think as a back four, their positioning and the fact that the ball wasn't intercepted before even it even got to Bailey. That's the problem. Forget the fact that it got to Bailey at the far post. How it got there is the issue. That's the problem with Arsenal. And we've been giving credit to Arsenal defensively and rightfully so because we've only conceded four goals since January. So they deserve fucking credit defensively, 100%. But the thing that I disagree with troops on regarding who to blame this season, I think they have a little bit of the same thing that we have, which is the forward line. And when I say the forward line, I'm not singling out individuals. I'm saying overall, the forward line has a problem. Like, there's such a lack of clinicalness. You, Arsenal kind of went through the same thing with Liverpool, where you had a period of like a month, month and a half, where you're just ultra clinical, taking your chances, scoring goals for fun. Like, we beat Brentford 3-0 and then beat that team 4-0 and 4-1 and 4-2 and blah, 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 all that shit. But then when it doesn't go your way, when it doesn't go your way, what happens? This is what happens. Now, had Arsenal, you know, lost to Spurs away, drawn to Spurs away, you know, had Arsenal lost to United away, drawn to United away, fair. It's Derby, big game, all that shit. But Aston Villa at home, you're expecting to beat. And by the way, I will refuse to change my opinion on Man City. Man City are going to win this league, not because Man City are brilliant. Because we, and when I say we, I mean me and him, done this to ourselves. We screwed us, you know, since the guys are WWE fans. Brett screwed Brett, you get me. Liverpool screwed Liverpool and Arsenal screwed us. <laughs> This is the harsh reality. Had we just been actual serious clubs, I, I just mm -hmm. want to ask a question, and this this applies for the Liverpool section. Is Ivan Tony worth seventy million now? Is he worth seventy million, or is he still twenty eight and he hasn't trained for six months and all this dumb shit that you guys are saying? Who don't hear must feel, Habibie. 
feel yeah, man. Right you can't hear most Maybe people. next year, when we say facts about our clubs, you wouldn't sit here like clowns and say "hab chest" and all these fucking buzzwords. Time but to grow up. If, if, but yeah, if but they're not. But before you go, Hamza, they're not going. That's, to. That's like cold. I said, they're going to be here again. You said clowns like Ray Ray. Like he's going to continue to sheep. Whatever happens is what is what follows. One hundred and ten percent. And that being said, speaking of sheep. Speaking of clowns, speaking of Ray Ray, is the 16th. You lot have asked for it, so the site is up, people. I'm going to drop the link in the chat. 16 out of 10 tees are available to pre-order. I'll drop the link in the chat in a second, people. Sarcasm City Ooh. TV. What is it? One second. SarcasmCityTV.MyShopify.com. I'll drop the link in the chat in a second, people. But tees available to pre-order. Go check them out because you lot asked for it. So it's only right it drops on the 16th. So, yeah, big up, man. Go on, Hamza. I was going to say, let me ask you a question about this. Imagine Arsenal had played Villa first and they lost 2 0, and the game goes to Anfield. Do you think Liverpool wins that game? Because, do you think because Arsenal must have been a bottle job? This Liverpool just lost, you're hearing the news, it's now in your hands, son. It's now in your hands, you're at home. Yeah, I think Liverpool with the experience. They win the league. The second criticism, I forgot to tell troops. They win the league. Their the fans. Their fans, you don't walk this up. This is true. This you is don't true. Walk, you don't up. walk up. We this never walked up. Listen, we never walked up QPR last game until the final whistle. You don't walk up. Anything can happen. You stay until the final whistle. I can't lie, troops. He has a point up. there. The stadium was walk. empty. Stay. The players. That's the second year in a row as well. They did that against Brighton last fans season. Don't. The they can't be walking. Don't up. believe they can't be in that team deep down. They don't have confidence. They walked up. They felt forget this. We we're not we're not spending time here anymore. How can you leave? City have been two 0 down, multiple occasion. Their fans are there until the final whistle. Imagine the QPR game. We were losing the game two one. We stayed there. We knew that they needed us until the final whistle. Arsenal fans bottled it as well. Arsenal fans. Walked away when their teams needed them, and I was shocked because they don't believe in the team. Arsenal fans don't believe that the team can win the league. It's simple as that. Because I don't believe in Anfield or myself. You see an empty stadium like that. We're being called empty. You're empty rats. You're empty. <laughs> you're empty rats completely. But Let me tell you something, blood. Even though we emptied, we still have more fans in our stadium than you, blood. Even with all that empty and blood, yeah. So shut, hold that blood, yeah. Fucking hold that blood, yeah. Try to tell me, blood. Fucking hold that blood, yeah. I can go on fucking line and get a season ticket now for your club, blood. No, There's a not. fucking fifteen year waiting list for a season ticket at my club, blood. Yeah. Remember that, rude boy. But you yeah? walk away so anyway. Fuck, so, so fuck your fan base, blood. Yeah. And fuck your fucking stadium. You fucking running track stadium. Man, fucking mad. The fucking the Commonwealth Stadium, blood. You get the fuck out of here, blood. The real talk, blood. Troops I think gone, the man. most surprising thing about that Arsenal game for me, though, was the second half. Because, like, the first half, like, Villa looked good on transition, but I felt like you had a little bit of control. And you saw the first 20 minutes really well. There was some nice forward passing. I thought Saka was actually doing pretty all right, and you were making a good amount of chances. Um, Second half, though, everybody second. faded. Everybody mm -hmm. faded, and like that would be the one thing I'd be worried about the most coming out of that game. The second half, like the game management weren't good, the individuals weren't good. It was just an overall team collapse, and well, you know that's that something you don't need to work on. That second half was close. Even Odegaard's second half. You know where that stems from? Pressure. Well, Pressure. do I talk about all the time when it comes to Manchester United? And in particular, I'm talking about Ten Hag and what's going on this season. And it happened that we watched that. That wasn't physical. That wasn't a technical thing. Arsenal don't play like that if that game's in October. But that pressure's different. And you know how you know the pressure's different? Look at the reaction of the Arsenal players once the game was over. That's just not a normal loss. They've lost mm. games before. They've lost games this season. It wasn't that. that pre mm. And people really underestimate that all the time going into these type of games and being in these type of situations. Yes, I predicted Arsenal to win the game, but eventually I was expecting a game like that from them because the that's where the actual quality shows. Troop spoke on about fine margins at these points. Just making the wrong decision for a split second can cost your team a goal. And then all of a sudden you're 1-0 down, 2-0 down. Bear in mind, they played against Villa. A good Villa played well. They weren't exceptional, but Villa played well. They did transition well. I do agree with that. And that's just the difference. And this is why I've said on this pod, yeah, I run jokes about it and it's funny, but the Arsenal lack quality. 
in particular down the spine of their side. When I look at their midfield and I look at their striker and I look at previous sides that have won the Premier League, they severely lack in that area. That doesn't area. That doesn't mean they're not good. Yeah, gender rate, aside, Havertz should have got two goals. I, like a gender aside, enough. like I rate, like I run jokes. I rate Rice. Rice is a, a very good midfielder. He's been one of the signings of the season. Older guy, I think, is top quality. But when we talk about going on to win the Premier League, that's a whole different kettle of fish. I was making this point since the inception of the Premier League till now. Every team that has won the Premier League. Bar Blackburn Rovers has had an, an elite, world-class talent playing in central midfield. One or two. The only exception is Blackburn Rovers. There's a, there's a reason for that. Whether it's Fabinho, whether it's City with all their players, whether it's Chelsea, whether it's Arsenal, whether it's Manchester United, even um, Leicester with Kante. You have to have somebody in there. And again, people, that doesn't mean I don't rate Rice and Odegaard. But when we compare them to the levels of the players I'm, just, I'm talking about, they come nowhere close. That's the difference. That is kind of like Prime Fabinho was a stone cold killer when it comes. That's to the point. That, that's the point that I'm making. Prime Fabinho was on. You it, had bro. Fabinho, was, who's there. He was looked like, at as best DM in the world for a period exa- of three years. No cap. Exactly no cap. my point. And this is the point I was making. And people severe. Oh, so you don't rate Rice and you don't rate Odegaard? No, I think they're very good players. That's why Arsenal have had the season they've had. That's why they're where they're at currently right now. But compare them to the players I've just named in those sides. Some of the best midfielders we've ever seen, and it matters. You have to go and improve in that area. You have to. Strike is a little different because your wingers can pitch in with the way the game's changed, as we've seen with Liverpool, with Firmino, and then you had Mane and Salah. But central midfield, people rarely underestimate that. But all right, carry on. We got Jeremy. What should I say? Jerome. He just dropped down, bounce blood. We got Ilya one more time. He says, Xhaka leaves and makes history in Germany. 120 years and no title and wins. Congrats to Xhaka and um, by Leverkusen. Can I congrats got, Leverkusen, man? We got Jerome one more time. He says, yes, cooked that Drake 2.0 lookalike. I, I don't know what this guy's on. If yeah, I don't know. Or... I think I he was talking about Hamza with the clip. Maybe it was that. Oh, okay. With the clip, I think it was that. But shout out to Drake because the diss track. Hamza was good. looks like Drake. Well, you need the glasses. I don't get that. Trust yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, I like the diss track. Shout out to Drake. It was a good diss track. Big up Hussein. He says, <clears throat> Wallahi, Hamza is a legend. What a guy. He's a wild blood. <laughs> <laughs> Big up Woods. No, did he? He says, Wait, hold on, guys. Are you telling me the reason United had the treble is because Arsenal bottled the league and they pick up that season? Oh, Jesus, big up, man. Then, yeah, <clears throat> no, not solely. No, it's because we had also an incredible side and they knew that he was getting ran down by an incredible side. That's also yeah. what it is. Let's not, no, it let's, blood. We, we let's not the league. you won the league by one point, blood. Allow it. No, no, no. When I say ran down, I'm talking you was ahead. Was you not ahead yeah. that season? No, no, no ahead. That season. go ahead. You was never no, it was that season. It was the ah, season. It was the it was the lead season when Viduka fucking done man. Oh, no, yeah. no, no, no. That, that season. That season. Like, Hamza, Hamza, don't tell me about my club blood. That, yeah, that season. Has about don't tell me about my club blood. Has that was not. That, that, don't tell me about my club blood. Don't that tell was me about the my season, club. guys. Go and check don't it. Tell me about my club blood. Just to clarify, he was in competition with an absolute exceptional side. So give credit. Don't this guy. This guy. This this bold fraud. I'm talking about my club. Yeah, yeah, yeah. troops. It was Wednesday. Hasselbank scored a diving header. Bro, we lost the league by one point blood we had a game in hand to win our game to go top blood stop chatting Ooh. shit blood seriously Someone stop chatting it. shit bro we literally had a game in hand that midweek and we win that game we went top we lost yeah. the game one nil so tell me about my own fucking team bro seriously nah man. troops i've got Sharp, you man. seriously <laughs> blood. we got mohammed anyway blood ray ray pussio you embarrassed pakistanis troops <laughs> and me swear I got it. it down ray ray's pakistani yeah 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 you, you know. shoot yeah swear troops. down he's pakistani you didn't know no. he's Pakistani. All right, yeah, yeah I didn't yeah, know yeah. that either. Yeah, he, he is. No. Yeah, he is. Nah, this guy's nah. Yeah. This guy's rough, he is. Because that's why when man. like the crickets are, he's always taking shots at India. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got Jason. He says, "Put your plates out, Hamza Biriwani served spicy." Yeah, this guy's always mm. eating some food on his fucking streams, blood. My we neighbor got me some food. Yeah, I always see that blood. Oh, my neighbor, look, we have some Romanian rice. Whatever, man. <laughs> we got Jack. He says, this is actually a smart smoke screen for by troops. Bring in rambles and you won't have to address the bottling. Next level, still no high hole. How do I not have to address the level? Me bringing this guy in is the worst thing you... Big up Herman. 
says Gabriel Jesus has missed 90 big chances this season and scored four. And Zinchenko is a bum. Get these city reject double agents out of my club ASAP. Oh. <laughs> I echo them thoughts, blood, big man ting. Big up Pratik. Yeah, I'm not even singing that blood. Funny, big up funny thing, he's a Spurs that's fan. That's crazy. That's a crazy. That's a he crazy. Says Saka being hanging around Diddy too long, always limp low it, blood. Yeah, Me blood clot. <laughs> Let him know, troops. Come on, you gunners. We got Ben Highsmith, my Gigi. We got Fats. He says, I heard Arsenal Utes compared to something. Nah, now nah, you're chatting shit, blood. Like, you might have just chatting shit. This actually happens, by the way. That's true. That's true, you know. Ooh. Never Space underestimate your family. Hey, no, 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 no. Never underestimate. That's exactly what happened. They didn't compare him, but the statement was as follows. I wouldn't trade Saka for Messi. Messi. I was shocked. No, no, no. That's, that's, that's... <laughs> Brother, so, I will take this version of Messi. I'll take this version of Messi in my team. Right now. Yeah. The Inter Miami one, bro. That's a shame. I'll not trade Saka for Champions League. We got Din Shen. He says Hamza Saka was limping and not break dancing. You call that break dancing, blood? We got South Paul. He says troops. The only managers can pass the line is Zidane, Simeone, and Angelotti. I will take all. Of them, I will take them all day. He is him, and Odegaard is the only one, is the only who wants to win. Only one who wants to win. My brother, those three managers, you can't get any of them anyway. That's the, that. I think that's Troops's point to begin with. But that's on that's the board why. to go get a manager who is good enough. Yes, there's no obvious names, but that's why the board have paid big money to go and locate no, no, these managers. Dallas, I don't mean this in an insulting way. Please don't take well, it that way. But yeah, yeah. our clubs are in a different position. I'm being dead serious. Troops' club needs like one step to win. Yes. My club, even with the current position that we're in, could possibly oh. need one step to win. Type Agreed. shit. So Agreed. Like if you tell me Zidane and Chilotti Simeone, I'm I'm with yeah. you. But Agreed. the others, flawless, they're a massive risk because the yes. reality is you don't even if they've won in their respective countries or whatever, yeah. you don't know factually if they would yeah. do better than Arteta. You don't. Fact. That's the problem. I, I I agree, but you are paid big money to take things that are risks. Yes, you want to take calculated risks, but the only other alternative is to stay with a manager who's not good enough. That's plain stupid. This is why you are paid millions upon millions of pounds to make these tough decisions that you will be judged on. Keeping our Arteta is not the way forward for Arsenal. Yes, there isn't no obvious candidate right now that is, you can go and look. But again, that's us five on here. You lot have much more resources, much more knowledge than us in regards to these things. That's why you are paid the amount of money you are paid. You are compensated very well for doing an extremely tough job. Go and do it. Big up Southport. Well, that's just me. Well, go on. He Fair. says, Lewis Palmer, oh my God, tell Madwike he is not him. Yeah, I was going to say, tell my manager to pick a designated penalty taker, but he's finally sorted that out today. So hopefully we don't see this issue again. Big up A. He just says bald fraud. It's a professor, blood. Big up 300. He says lab what? Labrador's live Is that a Labrador? Years. Labrador live 10 years. We'll win. Ever see a title? Oh, my <laughs> when the dog has got so many fucking strays, oh, it's unbelievable. Ah, he's a gooner. He can hold that. Big up Vic. He's a dog, brother. He says, last Aye, three seasons in April, AFC, three wins in 14. Bad month. Great. Mr. 16 out of 10. No way people are saying we should have kept Fabinho. He was finished. Would much rather have Maka or Endo as DM. Rice can be compared to Fabinho. Nobody said that Fabinho... <laughs> you should have kept Fabinho. That was not a part. This guy just don't listen. He just don't. You see why I completely ignored that flawless point. <laughs> yeah, he just don't, don't say that. Hey, go get your sixteen out of ten shirts, people. Hey, okay. troops, you need to add the clip to your so you stream yard so you can just run it. Yeah, I know, man. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Big up Todd Miller. Out of Charles. Out of Charles. Big up Daniel Reese one more time. He says I wouldn't trade Saka for Mbappe. Arsenal fans said that. Wow. Hello, troops. What are you saying? Yeah. Can I just cook my own club and fuck all this? Why? Like, let's just, let me just shit on Why my own club. Why can't we cook? No, you can cook, but I just want to shit on them first. You get right, them, because on. we deserve it. 
and 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 and, and listen i want to start first of all with all the rare super chats Can you please just bring up the thing that i just shared on the screen because that's something that i want to address and this is exactly rare this is exactly why you're called a reactionary prod guys men lie women lie numbers don't on the red big chances scored on purple big chances missed i'm supposed to believe the guy oh wow what no no wow. no 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 before you go before you go where did you get Flawless. this from? let me explain to the people this this graph right here yeah, 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 yeah. this does not count penalties this does not count a shot this has nothing to do with conversion rate this is big chances missed versus big chances scored according to ray ray and the reactionary fucks who just ride the train who just ride the same shit because rivals i woke up today and i had 15 fucking notifications on youtube mo salah mo salah mo salah just the dumbest fucking narrative i've ever heard my whole life there's two fucking good forwards we have both of them are 50 percent i know factually numbers don't lie Create Salah, two big chances, I get a goal. Create Jota, two big chances, I get a goal. Period. Full stop. 15 big chances missed, 15 big chances scored. Jota, seven missed, seven scored. According to Ray Ray, according to Ray Ray and according to the reactionary bastards, I'm supposed to blame the 50% people, not blame the guy who has 32 big chances missed out of 39 created, or blame Luis Diaz who has 10 big chances missed out of 16, or Gakpo who has 9 big chances missed out of 13. I'm supposed to blame Mo Salah. This is the people. This is my problem when I have these conversations with the people. The reason why I brought up this graph is, as you can see at the top, this is just big chances scored versus big chances missed. This doesn't count penalties. This doesn't count someone shooting from 30 yards. None of this shit. I'm talking about crystal clear opportunity right in front of goal. What happens? And when you look at the discrepancy with the other two, I am yeah. supposed to, Wild. I'm supposed to, as, as a normal human being, unlike Ray Ray, I'm, I'm supposed to, as a normal human being, say, guys, the reason why we did not win the league is Mo Salah. Because he only scored 15 of the 15. Like, he only has 50%. So every two big chances we, we, we create him, he scores a goal. Guys, our season was over at Old Trafford. Fuck all these games. Fuck all this nonsense. Premier League season was over at Old Trafford. Season overall was over in Atalanta. This is it. The, you guys live in your fantasy dream world. Troops today was in my chat when I did my rant on my channel. He commented a comment. I quoted him earlier on the Arsenal section. I'm going to say it again. In life... You must be a leader, not a follower. You must state your honest opinions. And if you get cooked or if it goes wrong, hold it. Who gives a fuck? Just state your honest opinions. I was saying Liverpool Football Club cannot win the league for a good reason. When I was asked on the Back Again podcast and on my own channel and everywhere the fuck I went, what do we need to do in January? I said, sign a forward and sign a defender. Everyone on this panel knows this. That's the reason why I said we cannot win the league. Is Ivan Tony worth 70 million now? Yes, he is. Because if I gave him that 32 fucking big chances missed that that donkey has, we would have had, we'd have been top of the league by fucking nine points already. We'd have been league champions right now. When it comes to this conversation, there's, there's a reason why Manchester City came to Anfield. We drew. Three quarters, 80% of the Liverpool fans acted like it was a good result because we were top of the league match day 30. This is my problem with people. Short-term thinking. Stop trying to be top of the league match day 30. Start trying to be top of the league match day 38. Manchester City, you beat them at home. You kill off their momentum a little bit. Perhaps they can't come back from it. Maybe Arsenal beat them as well and then they get, they, they, they get a problem here. Maybe they're doubting themselves. There's stuff that's bigger, the intangibles of a title race that people don't feel. How many times are we going to lie to each other? How many times are we going to lie to each other? You're coming up against Pep Guardiola. You're coming up against Manchester City. We already knew this from the start. You cannot afford to drop points. Fuck all these games that people want to play. We drew away at Old Trafford. Oh, it's fine because this and that happened and blah, blah, blah. And this team and goal difference and all these fucking buzzwords. We're not good enough to win the league. This season's a failure. Full stop. Failure by by far. And know what's funny? No, all the people are switching their energy. Um, Hussam, at the start of the season, we were only a top four team anyway, so we achieved our objective. You bunch of fucking bastards. We were top of the league, five points ahead of the team in second. Five points ahead of the team in second. And of course, out of context, Ray Ray strikes again. I'm not going to read it because it's fucking pointless. When Mo Salah was out, I'm going to address this one last time, Ray Ray, because if you bring this up again, I'm going to take a flight to the UK. I'm going to punch the fuck out of you at the fucking airport, get arrested, get deported back home. When Mo Salah was out, Diogo Jota was in the motherfucking team. 
Diogo Jota is the only other player who is also fucking clinical. Mo Salah and Jota have not played enough together this season. They haven't. They have not played the fuck together. They have not played together. So stop saying shit out of context. The reason why we were okay in that period was fucking Jota. Not Diaz, not Nunez, not Gakpo. And I'll, un I'll, un I'll unpack one last thing just on the Salah debate before I genuinely just fucking go in on this football club. B big games this season. Mo Salah doesn't turn up. Sell Mo Salah. Send him to Saudi Arabia, this belly dancer. Okay, let's unpack this statement right here, right now. Let's start with the team at the top. Manchester City, away from home at the Etihad. Assist, 90th minute. Layoff into Trent Alexander-Arnold, goal. Manchester City at home, who created the most dangerous chance of the game as soon as he stepped the, the fuck onto the football pitch? Mo Salah. Into who? Luis Diaz, who missed the tap and right in front of goal. Arsenal, who gets the ball right wing, dribbles past Zinchenko. Gabriel scores a goal near post against David Raya at home to Arsenal. Oh, guess who the fuck? Mo Salah done that. Um, Arsenal away from home. Mo Salah doesn't play. We lost 3-1. I thought we'd be fine, right, Rere? Your reactionary fuck. Spurs away, away from home. The most dangerous chance created in the whole game. Luis Diaz, Tappen. Mo Salah played a 35 pass, 35 yard pass. Tappen into Luis Diaz. Luis Diaz missed the chance yet again. Spurs at home, we haven't played yet. Chelsea away from home. Remember the assist to Luis Diaz? First game of the season, 1 1. Remember that pass. Go watch Scored an offside goal, too. Yes. Remember that, that goal to, to, to that pass to Luis Diaz. Manchester mm -hmm. United. Away from home at Old Trafford. Who missed the easiest chance of the oh, game? Oh, left back. Darwin Nunez. Manchester yeah. United at home. Dumb and dumber. Collision at Anfield. Nunez in front of goal. He decides to, to, to basically shoulder barge Diaz. And Diaz shoulder barged him. And they collided. And no one scored. And then Cody Gakpo, because he's a coward, gets the ball in the 90th minute in front of the fucking goal. And he decides okay. to shimmy, 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 yay, shimmy, ya, yeah, And then end up fucking <laughs> not the ball to the Yet I'm supposed to sit up here and blame Mo Salah. Even yesterday. What it's was the easiest it. chance of the game missed? Curtis Jones. What was the second easiest game of the chance missed? Jota, right in front of the goal, tapping. What was oh the third God. easiest chance of the Hamza? What was the third easiest chance of the goal missed? Darwin Nunes, right in front of goal. Sell Mo Salah. Get rid of Mo Salah. Now, Mo Salah in this Premier League, second most assists in the whole league, most big chances created in the whole league, third most goals. That's who I'm supposed to get rid of, guys. But I'm the crazy one. I'm the crazy one. Now, back to Liverpool Football Club. We're failure. Woo! There's no need to blame anyone else. We have failed ourselves. Pep Guardiola was not managing Crystal Palace. Arteta was not managing Crystal Palace, we created enough chances, and yet again, we do the same fucking bullshit over and over and over and over again. Every single one of these forwards can fucking hold that. And I feel like dumb, dumber, and dumbest have just infected the fuck out of Salah <laughs> and Jota. Even Jota now, even Jota's missing tappens. Bro, people would say Jota is like a like fucking goal scorer. Yeah, you know, yeah, that's his that's even he's good. missing sitters. Flawless has stopped asking me name the clear-cut chances because the whole game is clear-cut chances. Game. The whole fucking game from start to finish is clear-cut chances. Yeah, clear -cut well. chance. After clear-cut chance. Yeah. Defense wins you titles, attack wins you games. We don't have the defense and we don't have the attack. Enjoy, Habibis. Enjoy, Habibis, by yourself. My season is done already. From now to the end of the season, I'm doing vibe along. And to all the Liverpool fans, we take... <laughs> Mathematically, let me be a nerd. Mathematically, the season is not done. Mathematically, <laughs> mathematically, mathematically. Yeah, I will give you everything you ask for right now. Arsenal are gonna lose two games. Oh, City are gonna lose two man. games. Okay, خلاص. Let's shake hands. We're gonna, we're gonna lose. He's are good. we gonna win? Six? No, the fuck we're not. So we're not winning the English Premier League. If City drop two points, we're gonna drop four. If Arsenal drop three points, we're gonna drop six. So stop living in cuckoo land. Stop. Come back to reality. I welcome you all with open arms into reality. Liverpool season is done. Jurgen Klopp ended his last season only winning the Carabao Cup. And we have fucking failed this season. Period. Full stop. And we only have ourselves to blame. No excuses. None of this rubbish. We only have ourselves to blame. And yeah, we're in this position for good reason. You guys didn't want to listen. You guys say, come with your chest. The same fucking bitch since you're Pakistani. You chutia. The same chutia. <laughs> Man, who told me two dialect. weeks ago. The wow. same Kuti, the same Kamina, the same Randi, who told me two weeks ago, come with your chest. Where is your chest, Hussam? He went from with Liverpool up the quadruple unbearable reds to congratulations, Arsenal, to congratulations, City. Nick your mind up, bitch. Anyway, season's done. We're finished. We lost to Crystal Palace 1-0 at home. We deserve all the smoke. 
anything that is going to come from any of these guys, we deserve it. We're going to lose the league because we did this to ourselves. So, yeah, I'm done. Damn, serious props. I was going to say, yeah, but like, for real, for real. Like, I swear, back again cooking's just hit different, don't they? They hit different, yeah. innit? They you know, hit I, different. I know why they hit different. Just straight because... headshots, word to flawless. Yeah, it is, is because, yeah, headshots, like the big yell on the ground. But yeah, like, it's, it's, it's outrageous, like, because <laughs> you already know, man. I, I actually had that as a bar. That was hilarious. I forgot about that. <laughs> it just hit me back. I said that in a battle. But yeah, anyways, as we were saying, you know why? Because Hassan's not here lying on his team, and then we have to say it. And then it looks like we're hating. But people say to me, oh, why have you not gone to Sam or cook to Sam or rare turtle? It's because sam has been honest about his team from the jump. Mm -hmm. how, can I, how can I criticize him when I agree with him on what he's saying? When he's saying Liverpool I only have themselves to blame. It's on Klopp. It's on the players. The forward line are not clinical. <clears throat> This is why they will inevitably sh fall short. And that's what he just said. And obviously, because he's watching with more intent and he's got more information on Liverpool than we do, the cooking is going to be better. So, hey, really much more I could say rather than it's not a surprise to me that Liverpool fell short. The cooking's for all of us. I'll yeah. do the work for all four of you, man. Yeah. Let me, let, let me just second that with one quick thing. You know what's yeah. happening currently on Liverpool YouTube that's so pathetic? Go on, go on. Now, here come the sad speeches. Here come the sad speeches, part of my fan base. 115, City cheated, City are a corrupt club. Yeah, I agree with you. Yeah, 115, they cheated, they won the jackpot. Who gives a fuck? Yeah, we were top of the league with five points ahead. Victim, we they love our them. own selves. Fuck Manchester City. We were top of the league with five points ahead. We didn't beat them at home. We we missed 500 fucking chances every fucking game and we end up losing the league. Stop giving these sad speeches. And the more pathetic ones are the one telling us, oh, the aim at the first start of the season was top four. According to who? What kind that, of dumbass loser? I'll be so serious. That, that's not even a Liverpool YouTube thing, though. That's a YouTube thing in general. The toxic positive lot, when they can't, when they literally have nothing to be positive about, will suddenly switch the narrative to what you've been saying about for months. I've had the same thing. Flawless said the same thing. Troops said the same thing. You just have realists and you have toxic positive people. And the toxic positive people will only follow the same tune as you when they literally can't preach anything else. Oh, you damn right, man. I ain't seen a Ten Hag in comment in my chat in months. You know what I'm saying? Exactly. Months. Mm -hmm. Quiet. You know, you know what? Edline of Ferranta is putting up the hundred <clears throat> signs. Yesterday I sent him a screenshot. I don't, I don't want to start B for saying anything, but I sent him a screenshot of a certain YouTuber, Liverpool fan. And I, I said to the screenshot, I'm, look, they're titling the videos the same way we do. They're saying the same exact shit we do. But the first eight months of the season, this is what they're saying. <laughs> Say it with your chest. We're going to win the league. Do you know more than Klopp? Do you know more than FSG? Why don't you believe in this team? You should support the team. You should back the team. Have you ever been to Anfield? Have you ever been to the UK? Are you a British citizen? Do you speak English? How many languages do you speak? What the fuck do you do? Have you ever played football? They just say... Are you oh, scouts? Yeah, Let your apologies be as loud yeah. as your disrespect to Endo. Let your apologies be as They clipped me up. Liverpool Twitter, because Gakpo scored the header against fucking Sheffield, who are 20th, going to get relegated. Why didn't you clip me up now? Yalla, clip me up. Do you Must want be nice. Do you want mm. apology? Do you want Gakpo apology? Do you want which apology do you want? All the fucking shit players that you guys die on their hill. At least I die on the Trent hill, on the Salah hill, on the Allison hill, on the Van Dyke hill. Fucking good players, bro. Fight for the fucking good players. Stop fighting for these shit ones. Every single one of you trying to do which shit stinks more. We have failed this season. And anyone who tells you anything else is a liar. The aim was not top four. When you're top of the fucking lead with five points ahead and you have City coming to your ground, that's not called, I wanted top four. Crystal Palace, by the way. Fucking Crystal Palace yesterday. Crystal fucking Palace. Mm. We have nothing to fight for. They're not Big in irrigation. They're not, they're not in anything. Like, we, we did, did this to ourselves. Facts. But and listen, before oh. you go, Hamza, and if you are going to clip that up, people, add this part, make sure you subscribe. That was a Palace team with one centre back, by the way. <laughs> if you in a back good. three. Yeah, but I had like a, I think a right back in a DM playing in the back frame. By the way, they defended so well. Yeah, I got a shout out them defense. They made like four big game saving blocks. But I mean, yeah, I hear your narrative as well. You gotta do way better against that sword team. I looked at their lineup and I just thought, yeah, cool. We're doing this hate along just to take the piss. I'm gonna see some goals. I was like, raw. They really can't score against them. I was even in your chat saying this Palace side has conceded the most goals after the 90th minute. Don't worry, man. Don't worry, you're going to get your goal. Don't stress too much. And then come back at full time like, Ra, you didn't score. You actually didn't score. Mm. It's and it's the same complacency that we've seen from Liverpool for weeks. We saw against um, United at Old Trafford and I said, you know what? They're going to go back to Old Trafford. They're going to right that wrong. You go and do it again.
Atalanta. You go and do it again. You turn Anfield into Scamfield. And now this against Palace. That's why there's I people, hear everything there's people you're who saying. Believe this we're is now four nil. This is now the constant. Yeah, that's BS. This is the constant now. You lot are just going to be wasteful like this. There's been enough games where you've had the opportunity to right these wrongs and you haven't done it. But I doubt you're going to get the apologies you deserve. Yeah, there is no apologies. The they ask for apologies when Nunes scores one goal. Gakpo scores other, but Sheffield, yalla, apologize. Yeah, Habib, yalla, come tell me, Hussam, you're right. Yeah, I don't want to be right. Do you think me and troops want to be right? Do you think anyone want to be fucking right on their football club? Bro, I want to win. I want to say I, I was wrong win. about I want to come here and say we are league champions. I want to celebrate. I want to do a 12-hour fucking celebration stream, get cigars, get my sunglasses, be a shameless fuck, but I can't because our club do the same shit over and over again. And when the season's done, I'm going to unpack this fucking club era. I'm going to do a three-hour special on, on my channel, just unpacking the fuck out of the reason why we fell off since 1920. Simple as. League's done. And Europa League is done. <laughs> For us to win 4 0 at Atlanta, we have to 80 shots. Yeah, 80 shots. Yeah, please. And the thing is, Sam, the thing is, I love this fan base from Liverpool. <clears throat> they, they don't have a winning mentality because they didn't see their team win a league title. So <laughs> these guys are not someone that have experience Here about winning go. leagues. I, I don't know. It's serious. I'm being yeah, honest. Finish now, bro. I love, like, <laughs> you know, I love, I love, I love your, your, your fan base. The way to be polite. Like, now, that all you do is talk about 1970s and 1980s. Yeah, you can watch your black and white TV at the end of the day and see. They were colored actually color at the time, and and pretend that it was, it was major colored. trophies. But a lot of your fan base have not watched your <laughs> your football club win a single Premier League, and 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 it's so shameful that club is going to be parading a Carabao Cup and not a single Premier League title to his fans <laughs> in his nine years in his life. What if you like, like, parade that? Yeah, I'm gonna go to the would have parade parade parade. in a full kind of parade. Yeah. Hey, if you ever parade the Carbon Cup, you're at finished. Least, no, no, if we parade the Carbon Cup, I'm gonna fucking die. By the way, also, by the way, also blood on Pochettino's hands for parking the bus at against least, those least, children, least, you disgrace. At least J Jason Wilcox and the likes of Kenny Daglish, Blackburn Rovers, and Chris Sutton, yeah, lifted the Premier League in front of their full, full stadium. They paraded in front of their fan base. Leicester City. Danny Simpson, yeah, they paraded. Robert Huth paraded in front of the full stadium, in front of everyone, fan base. What did you parade? Nothing. Empty stadium. That's why he'll be remembered as a legacy. And the legacy will be remembered. It. He paraded his, the champions. His final victory, season. Yeah. In his final season, he might end up as Ten Hag's first season. Uncomfortable conversation. Like Klopp might parade the only Carabao Cup that he laughed at Ten Hag. Hamza, tell me what's he uncomfortable called, about it. What well, is, but it's, it's true. It's true. He, no, he but I already told you we failed. There's nothing uncomfortable. But I'm just saying, that's, that's a fact. Klopp yeah, I agree season. with you. We failed. Klopp There's Klopp nothing season, uncomfortable. Klopp, people laugh at Ten Hag. Klopp last season will end up as Ten Hag first season. It's a fact. <laughs> He'll be remembered for that. Yeah, and the one thing about it, people remember, yo, you are the reason why you put our players under pressure. Liverpool are meant to do a documentary, I'm hearing. I want to see this documentary. My documentary is in Netflix. I don't know where you've read so this. I'll watch, it. I'll watch documentary. my documentary in Netflix. I want to see your documentary. I want to see your documentary. It's uncomfortable. That's a fact. They said Liverpool are doing a documentary. I need to see the Liverpool documentary the next season. I'm, I'm subscribing to Amazon, Disney Channel, whatever it is. Where, wherever you're going to find your documentary. I want to see your fan base. I want to see your team. I want to see the motivation speech before the Crystal Palace game. What did Klopp? I remember. Where, where are you getting this documentary? You know, I remember you. commentator said this. Who told you there is a documentary, Hamza? That's what I heard. Liverpool doing a documentary. I never heard that. I don't think, bro, Klopp said he's not going to do anything. I heard they're doing a documentary. I, had, I don't think they are. Yeah, 100% this season. That's no, what they're Klopp not. Got, apart. That's, the thing is, I want to see Hassan, yeah? People remember this. Ama Diallo started the dagger. Ama Diallo started the dagger of your downfall. Fact. If you That's don't win the league, no, it's a fact, hundred percent. I'm a Diallo. No, we lost Arsenal away three-one. Bro, are you joking? You could not beat the worst Man United team ever we didn't, no, in your own home. We beat you in but, January, bro. That was way early. Bro, they, no, but they, that's how, that's how I feel like that was a, because here's the thing: no one really counts that Spurs loss. Let's be real, troops. So that's the thing that, that was like our first loss of the season, and I think our confidence wavered from then. Remember, troops, they come, before the season started, they started comparing that Spurs. They said everyone's against them. They had to sack the referee. The, I was thinking, yo. Yeah, I can't lie. You man said that if you win the league and you just lost the Tottenham game, you class it as invincible. 
Yep. I, I remember that still. Yeah. And what does that have to do with anything? You lost blood. How can you be invincible, bro? That's what I'm saying. Yeah, that was a robbery. You even said it yourself. Yeah, but it, it, oh, it was. But then look, we got robbed for our... One minute. We got robbed for our 49, our, our 50th game at Old Trafford, blood. And even Flawless will put his hand on his heart. And even he will say, now, nah, banter aside, you know what? We when Rooney died, died do you mean? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. 100%. Rooney died, the treatment of Reyes. Yeah. Bro, that, yeah, yeah, 100%. The, what they did, yeah, they know what they did, in it, blood? Fergie... Yeah. He done what he, 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 I mean, what's he hey, doing now? Yeah, but the, fact, doing but the fact that you remember yeah, this, hey, 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 what, wait, what, what were we doing then? That city's doing now, 115. Bro, we, we didn't get a decision. Wait, 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 yeah, like we that's different, you know what I'm saying? We didn't get charged with nothing, just to clarify. That's city, we didn't get charged with nothing. Yeah, criminals, criminals, criminals. corrupt <laughs> people don't get charged. I'm just, I can't like you. There's nothing to cook because I agree. Wait, wait, with what you. did you say? Wait, wait, wait. I've never had politicians get charged. You hear politicians getting charged. Corrupt people, that outside because, of politics. Biggest criminals are politicians. I hear what you're saying with that. When you say, I hear that. Wait, wait. So politicians have don't... always bust case, so I slightly yeah, hear. Yeah, but, but we know why. Just but what shit, you know what he's doing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But the point I'm making is people go, <laughs> wait, don't people go to jail for corruption? Every day? <laughs> wait, yeah, for real, wait. Don't people go to jail every day no, for I had to bill it, man. I'm not going to lie. That's what I had to bill it, man. I can't lie. Yeah, man. People go to jail for no, when he already every went out for what a few talks. About, what are we talking about here? But go on. No, man. No, politicians don't go. To you know what's the similarity between City and United, Flawless? There's one similarity. Go you on. got the job done on your end. Simple as. The, yeah. the thing is, Flawless, let me ask you something. Go United worst team yeah. contributed to Liverpool's down for this. Oh, season. yeah, facts, man. Anthony facts. spinning around on his right oh, foot. Oh, it's beautiful. They thought they would beat Man United. No, but bro, so did I. They thought they would beat Man United at home. They don't look at the FA Cup. Put this out of my way. They cast United every single year. And United's worst team dunked and destroyed your ambition of a fake quadruple. And you're going to be parading a Carabao Cup documentary. They parade the Carabao Cup. The whole do it for Carabao Cup. I don't know where his documentary stuff from. There'll be a clock farewell parade. That's how they'll spin it. The whole clock, the whole do it. Oh, goodbye, clock. Bye bye, Jurgen. Yeah, there is no documentary though. Where the fuck? Nah, follow the documentary, blood. The whole Jurgen clock, like, do it for clock team was for what? A Carabao Cup? No, that's just for people's. You know what? That was for the season's been a failure, bro. To play on people's emotions because people heard that and was like, right, they're gonna go, they're gonna be extra. Um, what's it called? The like they actually like they got attribute boost. Yeah, the twelfth man. What that was the twelfth man, and because they know his clubs last season, not factoring in one they're just not good enough and two that's not even more added pressure because it is his last season all this extra stuff that don't matter that's what it is you yeah know you, you know what it is flawless you say you oh. say it about your own club and i'm gonna say it about my own yeah. club forget forget whether like emotional and mental and all this the players just not good bro the yes. play, like the people who are <laughs> let us down consistently they're not good like should we have do you guys want to have the sober like conversation? Alhamdulillah, yeah. I never called him Hungarian Gerard. Never called him. this guy yeah, been stinking the fuck out of the pitch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My number eight scores against Palace. Oh, man, you guys. They said he was a Hungarian you know, it's mental or it's Klopp's fault thing. Listen, Klopp's role is as follows. Even troops will say this about his own manager if the same scenario happens. Klopp's role is as follows: put the team in the best possible scenario to win. But the agendas. Could we have been 5 0 up against Old Trafford away from home? Yes. Could yeah, we have yeah, beaten yeah, Man City yeah. 4 1 with all the chance we created? Yes. Could we have beaten Palace just yesterday 5 1? Yes. Klopp cannot go on the pitch and score the tap for you. That's that's what Chelsea fans do. Blame the manager for everything. That's not me. The role there of you the are. manager. There you are. The role of the there manager. You are. Once, once there you are. Have, are. But Lewis, it's I been a while since we've got some potch prop. Lewis, Lewis, I keep the same energy. Same way. I don't blame Potch for missed chances. I don't blame Klopp for missed chances. Bro, the guy. Like his job is to give you something to get in front of goal. He doesn't. Yeah, yeah. You make the chance. How the fuck is his fault? This is the thing I'm saying. It's not his fault, bro. We the players are just not good. Why? Simple. No, no, by Hassan. Why did he announce his leave in January? What was the benefit of that? What was the benefit of him announcing and putting his player under pressure? I think that was responsible. I, no I think that was <coughs> one of the major response. That that bro, if I'm being told my guy is leaving, and I feel because the pressure was at Arsenal. And January, as soon as he mentioned it, everyone turned their eyes on Liverpool and say, You have to win the league. It's club last season. So I think a lot of your players bottled it because, bro, the pressure that he put them under was significant. No, no, they bottled it. They're not I'm telling you 100%. 100%. Because I said it to you 
that if, if you don't win the league, the league this makes no sense, honestly. We, bro, we bought it because we're not good enough. It's as simple as that. It has bro, nothing to do with your with your like actual mentality or whatever the fuck you want to say, bro. There's nothing has nothing to do with that. Sam, the team is, had this team is not a team that wins the league. Simple. Had we signed Ivan Tony in January and center back like like I said we should maybe right now no we're just not good enough to win the league full stop has nothing to do with the club announcement because if we if we've played worse I'd be like okay but we haven't played worse we've really only had one bad game where we were actually the worst team that's Arsenal away other than that we were the better team even in the games we fucking lost if we if we don't take our chances that has nothing to do with the man yeah the United game they were better they just didn't take their chances. Come on, mm. troops! Yeah. Like for real, it could have been five 0 up in the first yeah, half. Yeah, yeah, you like, I can't, I can't believe that you like missed so many. That's chances. the same with us with the Villa game. Like, if we took our chances, like Jesus had a chance. Trossard, fucking hell, blood. Yeah, the Trossard miss was crazy. I seen you post that yeah. as well. Like, oh how do you miss God. from me? How yeah, the do you miss was, from there, blood? Yeah, the Trossard one. That's was what I'm saying. Like, people in my chat were like, "Oh, our Teta troops." I'm like, "Bro, how can I blame him for that?" Yeah, yeah. Like, Thank I blame you. him for his. I blame him for his. I blame him for his substitutions and his in-game management, but. The first half, I can't blame him, bro. We open them up like a tin of beans, bro. Consistent. That's why it's, it's both sides. Players can take responsibility. Manager can take responsibility. Not so it's not just all Chelsea fans blame the manager as well, but we'll save that. Now, but I hear what Lewis is saying because when I was in that situation with Arteta, I was more on Arteta, blood. Now I'm not in that situation. I'm more look at the players because I look at what we've got. You get me going on. And I'm like, yo, are these men able to keep up? No, did he? You understand? And I don't think mm. some of them are blood. Yeah. But it's the weakest city side. Weakest city side. I've you seen. say it's a weakened side, but at, at, yeah, then again, it's not blood because you have a f <laughs> like your starting 11 is still a Premier better League. Than yeah, yeah, again, it's not even, yeah. not, forget, forget better. They've all won the That's Premier Sam's League. It, though. The starting 11 have all, forget the better. They've yeah. all won the Premier League. All of them. Blood. That adds into it. So they it all does. know that, yo, and respectfully, when they're in a race with Liverpool, City win, blood. So they're not like losing composure. They've been in a situation, blood. So it's 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 different for them, innit? You get me. Whereas Liverpool now, if you if I think if Liverpool had like Mane and their man there, it'd be it'd, it'd be more different, innit? You get me. Mm -hmm. I think it would be Liverpool chasing City, yeah. like right on their neck, blood. You understand? Mm -hmm. Or even Firmino, by the way. Yeah, even yeah, because what you're missing is that 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 player in the forward line to help Salah. So, so, because, so it, if, because if Salah don't do it, who's fucking doing it, blood? Kind like Jota, but Jota's injury prone, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. So yeah, yeah. he he he's not there on a consistent basis. So yeah. it drops on Salah, blood. Yeah. A City have had like KDB injured, Rodri missed a lot of games. Like, but Hamza, here's got, the difference, though. You're you still got better folded than in them, man. You got even as folded, yes, but people yeah, said Foden was not good enough. But you're better than them, ah. Hamza. People said Foden's can't carry City the way KDB carries. City. People can can't carry, carry them the way that KDB does, but he still can go in there and play a role and 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 keep the keep the team going, blood. Yeah, this season he's also got a lot of key goals for you, which yeah. I think has also been a big difference. All all this aside, so his confidence is through the roof. You're still better than them, and that's and what that it as was. Well. Because people kept saying, "Oh, City are weaker," and I agreed. See, this ain't the same City as last season in terms of mm. quality. I don't think you're as good as you was last season. However. Mm. Some I kept saying this all summer long. Okay, who's better than them? And I couldn't get an answer. Yes, you are weaker. You lost Gundogan. You lost Mares, for example. You're not the, their key players. Of course, you're not the same. But replacing them with Doku and Flawless, even the start of the season, yeah, when man yeah, was saying, yeah. "Oh, City ain't gonna four P. What was I saying? City yeah, not yeah. gonna four P. I said it. Unfortunately, when man was I saying, "Nah, it. it's Arsenal or Liverpool or I kept saying, someone's gonna like who's Chelsea." Better than like, them? Even people were saying Chelsea. Like you get me. I remember Lewis's <laughs> prediction was top four for Chelsea. Ah, oh, good times. Also, you respectfully, yeah. respectfully <coughs> City week is Nunes and Kovacic. Liverpool week is Bobby Clark. Do you understand? Yeah. Like, Our week different? is fucking El Nenny, blood. Like, come on. You understand? Come on. Fucking, fucking Zinchenko. Oh, my days. Bro. You know, I want my, to my, my, my week is Tyreek George and um, Jimmy you know Terraria. You know, you know, you know what? Our my issue is, your, your week is young. Our issue is, bro, Zinchenko is not young. You understand? You shit. There's a but, different but, blood. You but if it. you look at our bench, like Oscar Bob, Sergio Gomez, Scott Carson, Rico Lewis. Keep uh, going. Scott Carson don't sit on your Warhol. bench. That's Warhol. He literally he just sits the on the bench. Blood. Yeah, I mentioned that he's one. He's like a reserve they, player. He didn't put in the squad. Yeah, they do. They put two, they put two keepers. So do we. They put, they put, you put two uh, keepers on your bench. Oh, fair so do, yeah, so do we, blood. They, so oh, we need lineup. 
Look at Real Madrid. We missed two That's players mad. in the bench. Two players in the bench. And we had Sassuolo. We only do that in an injury in crisis. Oh, Carson. Well, yeah, like, like we say, yeah. your squad is still better than... Even, no, Hamza, even, if, Hamza, even, if, even if you don't think it's oh, level okay, for Manchester City, it's still better than everybody else. Otherwise, so like you're going to win the league. Old, like, that's, that's what it that's is. What it's still been better. Doing. I'm saying so, let's, because this time the guy tried to I'm a Cobham graduate the guy every tried week. to try to act like he's weak and shit. Yeah. He tried to act like he's weak and shit just because of Oscar Bob. Ortega, Ederson, Carson, <clears throat> Walker, Diaz, Stone. Yeah, City Ake, struggle gimmicks Nicole are the Lewis, worst. Manuel Akanji. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not even no struggle. Yeah, one second, your struggle, Fabio, your struggle Grealish, is Fernandinho you know and Rodri have, at centre back. Have yeah, you know what City have third ADD, world problems. Silva, they have Holden, third world Bob, problems. You Holden, see Holden, us? Want to keep now, going? Watch it. That is the exact terminology you use for City. Mm. City have third world problems. So City have a problem where oh yeah. my internet's not working today. Oh, I don't have hot water today. Um, I don't have like, like I don't have hot water until midday. You get me? They they've turned the hot water off till midday. We have issues where yo we're not having no food today. Yeah, yeah, yeah. we might we're die. Eating, yo, there's ten of us and we're all cutting a piece of this bread. This one slice of bread, no butter, some dry bread. Yeah. The bread's all off, dog. Yeah, there's all flies on the bread of them thing there, and we're here cutting it They're into moldy. ten pieces, blood, so yeah. everybody can eat. No diddy. Whereas you, man, yeah. are like, all right, cool. Today we're gonna have, um, we're gonna have fucking um, steak and chips. You get me? T -t -t today, today we're not going to the restaurant today. We're gonna have an, an organic steak from Whole Foods. Mm -hmm. Steak will cost fucking forty five pound on them thing there. You understand? What, and what their problem is they forgot to stock up on seasoning. You feel me? While we're here flipping teeth in, flipping bread and milk out the corner shop. You know, you Getting know chased time troops? for our lives. This you, understand? you know what's mad troops is before we move on? <coughs> Julian Alvarez, who's City's bench striker, me and you would probably take over three, four starting forwards like who start consistently in our team. Bro, let me tell you Havertz. He was starting Havertz. Over Alvarez, I will... Havertz. Gakpo Diaz, Nunez for me. Alvarez Havertz. over there. Havertz, your striker. Would you start ahead of Havertz? Who? Havertz? Yes. Yeah. Of course. Not down the middle, but obviously on the wing he would, but not in the it, nine. I, I would put him in the nine instead of Havertz, but obviously I, Alvarez, I'd play like on the wing, innit? So, Where? Martinelli would be benched. So who would be benched? So this, I'm looking at... Right, this, this, this is the City bench versus Luton. So Martinelli got, still. This is, this is your bench. Me this, this, this is your bench. Yeah, think, yeah. I don't think in the nine, I think this he's better on the wing or crazy. in the 10. So this he's is this is he's he's yeah, Hamza yes. as well. Andrew just showed me your bench, bruv. You yeah. don't start. No, 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 no. Look at this. Go you don't start, start, start Look Carson. at this. Look at this. Wait, 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 wait. Gomez, Go Oscar Bob, Kyle Wait, wait, wait. Hold up, hold up. You absolute disgrace, bruv. I'll bring up troops. We're not doing this, but I'm looking big up Andrew. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Big up, surfer man. Go like, where, where, where is Scott Carson? Go Real Madrid game. I said Real Gomez, Madrid. Bob Walker, Ake, Grealish. Yeah, the Real Madrid, Madrid game because you put your entire squad onto the bench in Champions or League games. I think we don't see through that. No, Imagine. Go Real Madrid game. Not this, this one. This is the guy I'm back. supposed to feel the fuck bad for. Troops is bench El Lenny. My bench Bobby Clark. Ooh, struggles. Let's just move on, man. Let's and in the Champions on. League, you put your entire squad on the bench. So that's I how Scott can Carson someone, makes it. Can someone send Lewis my bench against um, Aston Villa, blood? Do you know what? I'll, I'll bring, I'll bring it up myself. Yeah, get it. Yeah, because, I'll, bring, I'll bring up the Liverpool one just now. Oh, get the Liverpool oh, one. Sorry. Victim mentality. You know what? While you're doing that, let me just fly through these supers. What do you mean quick, feeling man. sorry? You're the one hey, who you opened up this kind of worms. No one here. too much love today, blood. I can't lie. You see when you see when it's some. You see when we're going through misery. I know it's blood. We get more love, blood. It's see, crazy. there we go, because the people care. Like, we yeah, do. they care, blood. Yeah, Shout out the chat. Shout out yeah. the chat, blood. Big up Hamza Shampoo. He says, Arteta <laughs> should sub in win for Zinni. Blood. <laughs> Zinni should even be on the bench, rude boy. Big up C24. He says, Hussam, my brother, I almost died laughing at your cooking. It was a legendary cooking, blood. I can't lie. I need to clip that. Big up Hamza Shampoo again. He says, you frauds. 1K likes. I'll donate 50 bucks. So right now we're He's a man on, of his word. He'll do it as well. Get right the now we're on six, Right now we're on six hundred and fifteen likes, and we got over four. We got over fourteen hundred inside. No diddy. We got your That's damn cool. selves, blood. Let's get them likes like up, my people. Mister sixteen out of ten. He's been going ham. Yo, big up Ray Ray, but I can't lie, blood. He's been going ham, blood. He says took two bad games for Hussam to write off Endo. Um, he's been a great signing for us. Him and Verge. Him, Verge, and Maka 
have been massively overplayed and are shattered. You know what's funny about this troops? Remember when I said, fuck the Europa League, let's play the bench players in it? Yep. Now look, fatigue. See? Fatigue, they're tired. <laughs> he said, uh, big up, um, Imran. How do you... Tahajud. What's that, Tahaja? Tahajud. That's what I, I, I said, Tahaja, but Tahajud, so I was close. Tahajud play, uh, prayers for City, 115. Oh minus God. 10 points, inshallah. Inshallah. Evil we got guy. Danny. He says, big up guys. Uh, Kutia, Kamina, and Choyota was spot on. Um, big up Hussam on cooking. Ray Ray, troops, you better take Urdu lessons from Hussam. This pod is fire. Come on, bro, blood. Big up your damn self, blood. We got JK. He says, Hussam speaking facts, but come the end of the season, I feel robbed. Potential one point at Spurs and two at Anfield versus Arsenal. All on v VAR. We got Jazzy. He says, Man City fan talking about fan base. <laughs> I, I, I had to tell him, blood, real quick, man. I, I had to slow him down like Bobby V, bro. We got C24 one more time. He says, Choco Megamind is right. Doku is for real. I don't know about that, blood. He's got potential, but I don't know about baby Ronaldinho, blood, man. I'm smoking budge. That's we got shame, Eli, my GG. <clears throat> he says, Shout out to my baller, Eze, and Mitchell, underrated left back. What a block that was, blood. That was a title, a title yep. block. I can't lie. We got Jazzy again. He says, Bro was prop supporting Chelsea before City got rich. Chelsea. Apparently, apparently, it was Barcelona. Uh, big up V1K. He says, Big up Bart Simpson in yellow. Haha. -ha. Hussam, your Fergie. No, Hassan. I think he means Hussam. Hussam, your Fergie is leaving. It's over for you. Flawless, your stream a lot. Flawless, you stream a lot. So allow these pods. With wires, it's 2024. Ha ha. Uh, wireless pods don't work well with StreamYard, my guy. That's Maybe, why I don't use it. Uh, our there you are. Is I'm sorry. Uh, you know, I apologize. We're a big club, <laughs> like from like we're actually I'm at a historic institution. Sorry, I have history. We were winning Champions League is when City were in Division Two. I'm so sorry, bro. City were in Division Two when? He was in blood in the flipping 90s. You was in flipping. No, but they didn't win Champions League. These guys. Champs League was only if you won the league. <laughs> you never won the league in the 90s. Oh, yes, yes the 80s then still. So. Uh, big up Tudor, or, or should I say Todor. He says, fuck Endo, <clears throat> Nunes, Diaz, Curtis, big F. Okay. Uh, big up the Queen City Red. Big up your damn self, uh, the Queen City Red. He says, big up all of you. Love from across the pond. Side rant. Anyone else tired of seeing keepers concede shit goals and bad passes out the back? This season, keepers have just been giving away shit goals. There has oh, been a lot of keeper does. errors this year. It's because everybody playing out from the back, so you're increasing that risk. Yeah, 100%. That's why. It's like Keepers are going to make mistakes anyway because it's just a lot of averages in regards to how many games are played. But the, the amount of goals we see, because even today, Puck, Pickford. Pickford trying to play out. Yo, just kick the ball, Hulk. Mm. What you do? I, 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 it's mind-boggling. I understand it's a philosophy and you want to keep the ball, but not every single time you play out from the back. Sometimes just go more direct. Troops, comparing adding Katia struggle to Alvarez struggle Come is on. like comparing eating sausages Let's with go. like, you know, what's it called? With the fucking, and the noodles. You get me? Yeah, even look at this. With instant compare. noodles. Like, today we have fried chicken. You know, that's the difference. Look, like, even this, compare fucking Fabio Vieira to having De Bruyne on the bench, blood. You understand? Like, De Bruyne bro. was in the bench. Yeah, can we just get <clears> just <throat> get to folding on the I don't want to. folding on the bench, blood? You get me? Hamza, no like, one come is on, buying bro. City struggle story. Well, like no yeah. one's buying. You got oh, fucking Jack it. Grealish on the bench. We got Smith Rowe, respectfully. Go. Like, come on, blood. Mm -hmm. Like, let's let's be real here, blood. Like, where's the Liverpool one? <clears throat> um, the Liverpool one, I can just read it out for you. But obviously, because Trent and Jota is back from injury, so let's keep that in mind. So oh yeah, like, let's keep that in mind. What a fraud you are. When my guys came back, how, from how am I being a fraud? Trent is coming back from injury. The look look at mean? Liverpool. Shop was like, okay, right, I would say it. Obviously, obviously, Bradley, uh, who started because Trent was injured, uh, Soboslai, Gakpo, Elliot, Trent, Gomez, Gravenberg, Kelleher, Kwanza, and, and Jota. You missed that Jota, did yeah? But I've already mentioned them. I said he's coming back from injury. Him and Trent, look at that. Look at that bench. Yeah, Your bench is better strong. than ours. But look at that. Yeah, that's the bench better is better than ours, blood. That's not no, a but, bench, but uh, troops, you don't have injured. That's the difference. Yeah, that is not a good bench. 
Yeah. Take Trent and Jota out it. That's a bang. I want to see a real Who's struggle. Our starters, to be fair. No, but <laughs> that's a real struggle. Come see third world problems. <laughs> like Keanu Dyer and that. Tyreek George. <laughs> Pick up Gilchrist. But... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you might you might at least dining at some sort of restaurant. I'm eating outside. <laughs> <laughs> on the floor, on the floor. I got David Washington out there. I I barely know half of these man. <laughs> no, I don't know none of them. Yeah, one. I don't even know. I don't even know. Yeah, I don't. That's the first. Time the only I've one I know is I really know is Chilwell, and I don't even want to know him like that. <laughs> In David Washington, Brazilian. <laughs> um. Yeah. Yeah. I think so. Probably. Go on, tell us he's a he's a wonder kid from Brazil. Go on, you know you want to hear that's what I thought. Right? That's what they yeah, yeah, that's what no, 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 that's what you want to say. Don't no, 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 they, no, that's what you they said. Yeah, yeah, they yeah. yeah. Like, but do you do you agree with that? I've yeah, never heard that said. before. Who said that? Who's talk out here talking about David Washington? When Who? they signed him, they were my president. Said, <laughs> Who said that? These this Chelsea fans. Shout yes. out Washington. Hey, you know what? You need to get some new Chelsea fans around you. I've never heard anyone mention David Washington in any way, shape, or form. <laughs> Wonder kid. Uh, we, we just shout out his Instagram post. Because hey, he always David posts Washington. some hype up little graphic for the game and then Poch don't even give him any minutes. Lewis. David Washington, Wonder Kid. Oscar Bob and Rico Lewis, struggle story. <laughs> Well, like, there's no point. <laughs> City struggle gimmick, bruv. Flawless. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go, blood. Here we go. All right, Lewis, get the league table, please. Because oh, yeah, here sure. we go. You see your life, yeah? Yeah. You think it's bad now? My life is great outside of these lot. Like, <laughs> outside in, of your, these lot. in your football life, blood, it could yeah. get a lot worse, blood. No, it couldn't. Are you sure? I'm positive. Even what if I know you're going to say Chelsea, if Chelsea catches, I right, so we drop from seventh to eighth. I keep saying this: you can't broke what's already broken. No, but it's where Chelsea were in the it, league, it's yeah. embarrassing. Where they and are that's, now, and that you know what that is? That's a fantastic story and a fantastic. Look narrative. at the point. Diff- look, what, yeah, it's three that? points where they get three, three points for the game in hand. Do you think they're winning their game in hand? Who's their game in hand against? You. I and top. Top is that one or top? It's one. Well, you only got one in us. You got two on others. Yeah. So like are they be so are they beating you? Nah. All right. Are but then you can but then you're no. liable to lose another game. Of course, we liable to lose any match. Don't get it mistaken. And that's what I was gonna get to. Is saying this is why whether we finish sixth, whether we finish seventh, whether we finish tenth or eleventh or twelfth, it's embarrassing. I've never disliked a manager or disliked the club as much as I do from actual top to bottom. Because normally at this point, I would have done checked out. If I wasn't content creating, I've stopped watching under, have you said this before, under Oli, I stopped watching under Mourinho, I stopped watching under Van Gaal, so I wasn't as in tuned as to what's going on. But because I'm content creating, this is the unfortunate side of it. It's embarrassing, absolutely embarrassing. And what makes the embarrassment even more of an embarrassment is our performances are no longer a shock. Everyone expects it. I couldn't care less for games. I said we had three games I cared about at the end of the season. One was Liverpool. We've got one coming up, the FA Cup semi-final, and the one against you lot. And two of those three were literally to spoil the party. It wasn't on us. Like I said, misery loves company. Losers lounge. And we welcome Liverpool to it, and, uh, and we're going to welcome Arsenal to it as well. It's about getting to the FA Cup final. If we see Chelsea there, could we win? Absolutely. If we see City there, long day. Long, long, long day. And it's absolute. it is. It's super embarrassing. I'm on watch-alongs and the man them are like, yo, who are non-Manchester United fans are like, can we join? And I'm saying, yeah, pull up. And we're talking about everything but the game. It's a watch-along, but there's nothing being watched because it's horrific what I'm seeing on the pitch from top to bottom. And I mentioned earlier how there's no Ten Hag in is no longer in my chat. No longer. I've not seen that in months. And I live stream every day. Not one person be like, you being harsh on the manager, Ten Hag in, Bruno's this, Ganacho's that, Rashford is this, etc., etc. Where you lot all at now? When I was criticising for months that I've been. And people talk about the performances like there's, there's much different. And people do this all the time, do too much results-based analysis. Because when we went on that purple patch and we was winning games, the performances was like this. The performances ain't any different. It's just that teams now, we're creating a little bit less and not taking our chances adding in Hoyle and getting injured even though he's back now and teams against us are starting to take their chances and your luck eventually runs out what did he always say cream rises to the crop uh, cream rises to the top 
temp class is what is it? Class is permanent, form is temporary. So you can be in good form, but eventually, if you don't have a certain quality, you are going to fall short. And over a long course of the season, which is 38 games, you're going to eventually see that. You can count on one hand the amount of Premier League games we've actually performed and played well in. Count on one hand and it, it won't even be full. It would not even be five. Probably be two or three at most. And a couple of them are probably for 20-minute periods, 30-minute periods or 45-minute periods. Awful. Awful. Bear in mind, I've been talking like this for the longest and I'm talking about this in this segment and it's nothing to do with the game. The game was just another shambolic embarrassment. Absolute shambolic embarrassment from top to bottom, both from a defensive standpoint, offensive standpoint, being a cohesive unit, etc, etc. And shout out to Saeed and it was Double A and Ash and we were talking about this on the Unfiltered podcast and how Palace went to Liverpool and how they performed. Forget the fact that they won. Look how Palace went to Liverpool and performed So it dis with injuries. So it dispels this whole myth that you need your the perfect 11 and you need a lot of money spent because there's a way to lose games. There's a way to perform in games. And you can have the worst 11 in the world and still be a cohesive and organised unit. We are one of the worst coach teams in the league. We are one of the worst coach teams I've ever seen. And the manager don't help that. And then on top of that, the players don't even have I don't know if it's the sense. I don't know if it's the cojones to take it into their own hands and say, this manager's not it. Let's just change it and just do our own thing. Because this can't continue. And we're going to go out there for the remaining six games of the Premier League and the FA Cup semi-final and despite results, perform like this. And people wonder why I'm on the manager's case. Why I say ACGI, anybody can get it and get rid of everybody from top to bottom. Why I said last week and I've said weeks prior on this very podcast, <laughs> Ineos, you're on the clock from now. Omar Barada, you're on the clock from that. Everybody involved, technical director, director of football, recruitment staff, everybody is on the clock to fix us. I'm not even talking about success on the pitch. I'm talking about giving us a platform to go and succeed. Because what I'm seeing week in, week out is an absolute, it's, yeah, and like I said, embarrassment. That's the best, it's shambolic. And I'm a, not even ashamed, like I'm broken to the point. You know what I'm saying? I love my football club, but I'm no longer in love with my football club. It's like a relationship and you know it's done and you stay in it for the kids. That's how I feel with Manchester United. I love you in name only because there's nothing about you currently that I like. Not love, there's zero about this football club from top to bottom that I actually like. I can't even pinpoint five, six, seven players where I go, yeah, like complete reset. There's no one I'm fighting to keep. Bear in mind, I've spoken on this and I even mentioned the game. I even mentioned how the fans still back this nonsense. Ten Hag falling out with players. Or they said Anthony was ill. How you falling out with Anthony? That's your guy. And you falling out with Anthony. And as for Ganacho liking tweets as well, I want everyone to have the same energy they had for Sancho. Have the exact same energy because it can't be one rule for one and one rule for all. And if it is, be honest about that and say, if a player is performing at my football club, I don't care how he's talking to the manager. But when it was Sancho, he was a crybaby. And he needs to he needs to leave. And he doesn't, he doesn't, he's he's selfish, like you know him. And he doesn't want what's best for the football club. So all right, so what about Ganacho? And Ganacho can't even say it was an accident or he got hacked because it was two tweets. So it's not even that. And he meant that shit when he said what he said. And I say this all the time in regards to managers. Don't call out players publicly. Was Ganacho partly at fault for the first goal? Yes, he lost the ball. But from when Ten Hager said what he said, even though he didn't mention him by name. You open that, you open up that door, and you have no cachet. Ten Hag needs everybody on side. But the way my man inside. dropped, blood, it's more him mm. than Ganacho. No, no, no. That's what I've said. Partly to blame. Campbell Wall yeah. is mostly to blame for the goal. Yes, but that's gonna happen. We've seen better centre backs than him slip. Van Dyke slipped. You know what I'm saying? Van der Ven slipped. We've seen this happen. You know what I'm saying? They all they're all on the, the, the beach. Man. Your people, they're all it? there. They're all yeah, man. But both my centre backs, I was devastated on Saturday, but Sunday picked me up though. But yeah, like that, but that's what it is. <laughs> like in regards to um in regards to Campbell Wilder. Of course he's most to blame. But the reason why I'm not gonna super criticize him, he had a poor game. That's his first poor game he's had all season long. If our other senior players had the consistency he's had and shown the fight that he had, guess what? We'd be okay. Because he's not the greatest center back in the world. But guess what he does? Most for the outside of that Bournemouth game. Does his job to a competent level. That's why I can't ask no more. Every time Campbell Wall has played in the lead up to the Liverpool game, people are talking about, oh, your defence is in trouble. Who's going to play at centre-back? And I said Maguire and Campbell Wall. I said I worry more. Little... Yeah, I, I worry more about Maguire than I do Campbell Wall. And Campbell Wall outside, yeah, he was awful. What like song. in that game. Yeah, yeah, great song. But we was all awful. Never mind Campbell Wall. How about the captain? 
out there just doing nothing. How about our attack? Again, did you watch the game? Um, I saw highlights. All right, so I'll, I'll tell you what happened. He was out there. Like I watched match playing. of the day, innit? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We was out there playing like he was in red and black. And that's a typical Bruno performance. Got two goals and offered nothing else. We had one shot on target in the second half. And I think it was the penalty. I think we had three full shots on target in the entire game. So that tells you all you need to know about him playing well. Our attack non-existent as as it always is. How Rashford is still starting week in, week out, I don't know. Because he's been bad the entire season. But again, that falls at the feet of the manager. It does. Defensively, Maino, which I knew was going to happen, is he's starting to struggle. And he still played to an OK level, but it was below par for him. Because Miro was awful. He was terrible as well. And has been terrible for the longest. And it infects you. Because it's miserable. There's Like I said, there's nothing good about the club. Misery, like I say, misery loves company. And that's what's happening. And it, it affects people. They say you are what you surround yourself with. And everything's miserable surrounding Manchester United. I just want the season to be over with at this point. If I could simulate the rest of and the like Premier League games... Lord, Lord just preaching everything he's been saying all along. And it's just... The reason why it sounds the same is because they have the same performances, bro. Like, it's the, it's same, the same. It's the same thing. You know what the only same difference shit. is? You know the difference. Uh, uh, you might the only difference. No, you your might opponents are not clinical. That's it. Yeah. No, no, no. I was gonna say sometimes it's in Manchester, sometimes it's somewhere else in England. Sometimes <laughs> we might be in red, or sometimes we might be in white. But that's the only difference. It's literally play. If our performances were played in black and white, it looks the exact same. So you couldn't distinguish. It was all shadows, and you couldn't distinguish players. Um, players' faces, and you didn't know who was who. We play the exact same way. This performance is no different to the Chelsea performance, which is no different to the Brentford performance, which is no different to the Liverpool performance. You know what it's dependent on? The opposition. How clinical they are, how good they are, etc. Bournemouth weren't at it, because Bournemouth didn't even play too well in the game and still hit the bar, I think, twice. Should have been out of sight, but there's a reason there where they are in the table, because they're Bournemouth. And any time we play the quality side, this is why we lost. And it's awful. We offer nothing offensively and offer nothing defensively. There's just no resistance. There's nothing. Zero with this club. That's why I say I've never disliked a, a manager at Manchester United and a set of You're players. You're generally just lucky your opposition for some reason just shit the bed in front of goal. I have no idea why the fuck it's happened to Liverpool. It's happened to Brentford. It's happened to Bournemouth. It's the you know same why that is, Hassan, you know why that is? Because the level of the Premier League is nowhere near where people think it is. This is true. This is also because true. Because people will look and go, oh, you got lucky. That's why I said it earlier on this show. What more could we have done to Bournemouth to help them win that game? We could have yeah, performed. They, they no, we could have performed them. no worse. We did everything in our power to allow Bournemouth back into that game. Everything. Everything. You know the blueprint. You watch one Manchester United game this season. You've watched them all, so you can easily scout for us. Easily scout for us. We're easy to catch in transition. There's nothing in our midfield. We're easy to get out defensively, and we offer nothing in attack. How much more do you need to beat Manchester United? If you've lost to us, that's on you not being clinical. Because for, for some reason, we'll get chances. We'll just get the ball forward and we'll manage to score. Was it a penalty? No. Bruno going to score a penalty, though. You know that. And we'll have players who will try things like Hoyland when he went through his purple patch. Bruno even somehow managed to get two goals. That's one of the worst two-goal performances. No, that is the worst two-goal performance I've ever seen. Because he did nothing outside of that. Same way against Liverpool, he got a goal. So he scored three goals in two games and has been rubbish in both of them. And that sums up Manchester United. Awful, awful outfit. And if anyone, like I'll continue to say this from now to the end of the season, anyone still backing this team and backing these managers and backing these players, open your eyes and look at what is going on. All the evidence is there is to make your, is to make your judgment. We are now at game week 32, I believe it is. Plus FA Cup games, plus League Cup games, plus a complete embarrassment in the Champions League, one of the most embarrassing European campaigns I've ever seen. How much more evidence do you need? How much more evidence do you need to convict them and say, you know what, this ain't it, blow it up and start again. I'm just glad the playoffs is here. That's what I'm on. Playing start today, I can't wait, NBA. That's all I'm locked in for. Tired of this. I need the Warriors to win. We need that. Yeah, they'll probably beat the Kings. <laughs> That's a Brooks thinks I'm joking, bro. I'm I'm gonna watch that shit Wednesday yeah, yeah, night. The, Warriors, yeah, Kings. Warriors, let's go. Yeah, the Warriors will put the will probably. I'm being serious. They'll probably beat the Kings. Let's fucking go. Come on. He's got yeah. more interest in that than football, blood. Oh yeah, hundred percent. You see my team. Our season's done. Your season might be done this Wednesday. Then we'll introduce you NBA. Don't worry. And bear in mind, we have a, a semi-final the FA. Come on, so get coming. locked in at this point. Yeah, look, yeah, come join fam. Hey, playback people, playback. You know what I'm saying? TV slash Sarcasm City TV. If you have an NBA league pass, boom. 
you can use it and watch along with us on the live stream. So yeah, come get involved as this football thing for yeah, I've been I've been on the beach for the longest. <laughs> Big up Alvin. He says Madwaki and Jackson, what a shame. Big up the podcast. We're literally yeah. flying, we're flying into that now, blood. Big up Todor. He says we should have said the we should have never, never said, said the Q word. The Q word. Ah, What's the Q word? Quadruple. Oh, He's there you go. Alhamdulillah, I never said that. Alhamdulillah. <clears throat> Big up Lee Slims, you. my brother. Big up Lee Slims. He says, lateness is greatness. Just got here first. Big up the panel. I was flying while the game was going on and missed it. Getting off the plane and seeing the loss hurt. Still not watched the game. We have to hold it. Come on, you gunners. Good to see that you had a safe flight, blood. And you probably wished it continued, fam. You understand? Man, like Sonny, he's moving mad, fam. We got 300. He says, Ganacho up in estrogen levels, indirecting like a gal. Oh, there, no, there were no indirecting. He was very direct. And then, big up Woods. He says, right before kickoff, United players should be saying F what this manager says and let set ourselves properly to win games. Mm -hmm. Lewis. Ah. Oh. Oh, wonderful. 6 0 victory, but the main talking point was Madweke, Jackson, Palmer, Gallagher. Are you taking them? Who's watching me, blood? Probably a Sam or Hamza. It's one of those. Two. No, no, that's not me. Wallah, that's not me. It's probably Hamza. It's Hamza. It's Hamza. Look at Hamza, man. It was Hamza. This guy does Look at his dickhead, blood. It's Hamza. <laughs> Look at the spot. Oh, okay. oh, wow. Are you taking the piss, blood? <laughs> yes. Hey, blood. But yeah, but the main talking point, Lewis, was that incident. But yeah, Cole Palmer, I can't lie. That so ain't the main Lewis. talking point. The main talking point is four Palmer goals. You're so shameless, I swear to God. Yeah, I'm gonna lie. Nah, point, perfect hat trick. <laughs> you know what the crazy part you know, is? Lewis, Lewis, he saw right wing and he was like, main talking point, penalty. Who gives a fuck? Yeah. Nah, you, you know what? The penalty, thing, no, you know no, what? No, no, no. the penalty thing, the penalty thing was funny though. It was just like, was don't, don't take anything away from that. Like, it was just that funny. was hilarious. It was just funny. Like, even my mom said to me, she was just embarrassed by it. You know what I'm saying? She was just embarrassed, just like, yo, yeah. I hope they know? watch it back afterwards because that was a whole load of stupidness. But thankfully, we're already 4-0 up. Yeah, yeah. Like th this is what happens when you don't have a designated penalty taker and the fact that we haven't had one has meant this has happened numerous times from Sterling and Palmer arguing against Arsenal for the first penalty there was Palmer and Sterling again for the Leicester penalty he was meant to take it but then Sterling asked for it there was Madweki trying to take the ball from Palmer at 3-3 uh, no at 3-2 against United I was like literally just go away right now big up Noni you need to leave this time it was like Noni's like no I got the penalty I, I want the goal. I want the goal. No, we, we are now going for the golden boot, my friend. We're now going for the golden boot. It's got to that point. Please respectfully step aside. But he didn't even get the penny. Yeah. No, no, Madwake, you got oh no, yeah, got called back for the Palmer soft yeah, before. Yeah, yeah. yeah, there was two separate instances. Okay. So yeah, point still stands anyway. Thankfully, Palmer and Potch have both come out after the game and said, No more of this crap. Palmer's our penalty taker. That's it. So I hope I don't see that crap anymore. Like, I was annoyed about it because I thought, imagine you do this, like, Saturday. It's 1-1 against Man City. And so, yeah, like, I'm not here for that crap. But 4-0, like, we've won 6-0 at the end of it all. It seems to have all been sorted. I don't really care too much about it. Like, whatever, what man. Jackson you tried to get a goal at like, 4-0. Why was he moving so mad? I don't know if he was trying to bat Madwaki or if he was like, no, 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 I want the pen. I want the pen. But, like, no, go. And this is why I'm going to shout out Conor Gallagher as well, because he did exactly what I want from a captain. Just get in there, end everything, and just get everyone back behind the line. That's what you want your captain to do, and he stepped up and he did that. So fair play to him. That, that's the sort of leadership that we need to see, and I'm glad that that's growing into him. You think, you, you think this is a confidence booster going into the City game on Saturday? I mean, City played before you as well, blood. They, play, they have to play again. They play what? Um, um, we we just better at this point. Like, I, how, yeah, they play on Wednesday. I am praying for that game to go to extra time. That's all I need. Just go to extra time, and like we might have a little bit of a yeah, chance so you're in winning that, that game. But... Up. You're winning it. Just give up. Yeah, yeah, sure, sure. 
Sure. Okay, Lewis. I hope you you're correct. Six, you have a chance like losing to prediction. Finals at Wembley, right? What? You have six. You have six in a row. You've lost at Wembley, right? What was the last one you won? Six finals. The FA Cup, yeah. Against Man United. Oh wow! Because it happened before. All right, cool, cool. Same. We have Same. to get to that final first. You know, Who we have to go through a whole Manchester City. Manchester first. City this season, best team playing against Man City this season, Chelsea. And Tottenham. no agenda, bro. Fuck the bias, bro. You put four past them with Rodri. Let's just cut the crap. Let's, 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 go. Calm. Must, let's hey, make hey, the hey, step hey. forward and win the game. Like, yeah, okay, must, cool. Man. Yeah, I'll say it, cool. I promise you you're beating. Yeah, like, that, that's hey, calm and everything. Yeah, like, you, you I, I'm going to believe it when I see it. I'm going to, I'm not going to jump to conclusions already and say, yeah, we're smashing Man City. We're all walking through Man City just to look like an idiot on the next episode. I'm good. It's a whole Man City. How about, how about you go and you do it? And then I'll believe. We beat Man City, then I'll believe you. Yeah, I'll believe we're going to go for the FA Cup. I believe we can win it. You need to beat Man City first. That's a lot easier said than done. How many hey. times have we had a confidence-building result and then we've just gone and fumbled the bag the game after? Not the falling for it. Today them. was excellent. Just build on it. You go build no, on it and then you know what? Make a believer out of me. What was that? I'm you saying like that today. I'm saying the way that you played against City this season is is why I'm saying what I'm saying. Yeah, that, that's that's fair enough. You're like playing well against playing well against City and beating City are two completely different things. We have to go and beat Manchester City first. As of right now, for this game, it's just everything that I could have asked for and more. Like we were creating a lot of chances, we were finishing a lot of chances. Thank the Lord, Beto didn't score that chance in the second or third minute. Or we're talking about a completely different game. Yeah, but Jesus. he missed, and and Palmer, Jackson, Mudrick all absolutely cooked. The the like the food that was on offer today was sensational. Link up play was everywhere. Palmer, as per usual. Just stunning. I run out of words to describe the football day he produces in what has been an absolute mess of a Chelsea team this season. I think we're now nearing 40 goals and assists for the season. Young player of the year charge, player of the year charge. We're going for everything with him. He has been unbelievable. And if this team can pattern up next season, God knows what he can bring to us. Jackson, the link up play, the hold up play, again, sensational. Mudrick had good moments in the game. Madweki was constantly driving at players and causing problems. Caicedo and Gallagher, unbelievable. Absolutely bullied that midfield. Won every single duel that they had to face in the game. Defensively, I've got to give Chalaber his props, Silver his props as well. The only real problem with us was, again, set pieces. Every time we had a set piece, it felt like we were going to concede, but we didn't. So thankfully, we never had to pay for any of that. But we we went, we bagged six goals. Palmer's got another hat trick. Second hat trick in two games at the bridge. All I ask for you is just try not to lose the next three and then the next four I need W's. Because like I understand we're going to the Emirates and we're going to Villa Park and then it's Tottenham at home. Like I can't ask I can't demand three wins in that game, but I can demand three good performances. And then whatever happens, we judge on a game by game basis. But we somehow are within touching distance of sick. And I, I I can't believe it, but again, I feel like I underestimated my own words from the start of the season where I said the race for Europe just isn't consistent. And this is yet another example of it. We could still drop points in the next three games and we probably still would be within arm's reach because Newcastle aren't a consistent team. Neither are Manchester United, neither are West Ham, neither are Wolves. So the ball's in your court. Like, we have fumbled the bag so many times this season. I am not going to come here and say I outright believe we can do it. But, like, you drag me back into believing there's a chance. Fair enough. Fair enough. Just go to Matt, go to the Wembley. Do what you need to do. Take anything out of that game at the Emirates. Leave with something. Uh, that's all I'm asking from you. Just leave with something on that game. And then the rest, we should be able to do something. At Tottenham at home, we ain't losing. We always turn up for Tottenham at home. I'd actually be confident we could win that one. Villa away, God knows. The other four, I need my Ws. And yeah, Cole Palmer for Young Player of the Year. And I want to re-vote for Player of the Year ASAP. 
Big up Coins Cove. He says, it's a bunk situation, but I'd rather be in a title race and lose than never be in one at all. Fat lady ain't singing yet. We go again. Come on, you gunners. Hey, one oh, yeah, so the chat as well was still potch out. Still potch yeah. out. Like, likes the yeah, baby, when it's Manchester City involved, the fat lady sang already. Yeah, the challenge, the, the, cha the we big challenge up the fat trophy. lady. Hey, hey, big up the we challenge trophy merchants, man. Love you lot, man. For real, coins is basically, bro. You know, the same team lost 4 0 to Newcastle. Mm -hmm. That's who you're lying on. You Come get on, me. man. Big up fats. He says, third player to score perfect hat trick after Giroud and Pulisic, A. Lewis, Poch, Multi. Militancy. He's well, a, he's an absolute disgrace. Yeah. Coffee. Eleanor is not watching this stream. Oh yeah, this guy's Poch in. Yeah, I forgot. He potched in because the Gyal trying to impress his Spurs fan, and she loves Poch. He crazy. Hey, we losing the, we disgrace. losing players to the game, man. We are losing players to the game. We're just gonna fly through the other results real quick, blood. Um, Newcastle four, Tottenham nil. Fuck. Oh, how sad. And that's why the fat lady sang. I, I was actually annoyed with that oh, result. And, I, you know what? And, and, I seen you, and the crazy part is I seen your uh, your tweet troops and I was like, look at this Egypt. And then guess what? Span the block instantly on the Sunday. <laughs> but Tottenham title four, title four, top four chances are um, in we doubt. Points, what, we three points behind Villa. Um, it's three, right? It's only three points. Oh, we got that, man. Top you're four, you're, you're not three behind Villa. Oh, you're Tottenham, huh? Yeah, Tottenham, we, man. We three behind Villa. Yeah, yeah. As we, got that as well. we, man. Yeah, we got but that. they got... Tottenham oh, got a game in hand. real mean with that crap. Yeah, who we got? Who, who's the game in hand? Who? I don't give a shit who they got. They got a game in hand and... Tottenham, that's us. It's us. Oh, and come. We got that. Villa come. have a better goal difference. Hey, what? Stamford Bridge away? Hey, man, we got you that draw. To draw, draw, you draw, to draw, draw, draw. Draw. This is me. Of course, I know my side thing. Draw or incoming. What are we talking about? But, um, yeah, <laughs> Isaac on absolute yeah, he was on smoke, smoke blood. Yeah, 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 Van yeah. der Ven. I've never seen a defender um, get the run around like that blood. You get me? Um, yeah. The two goals. Didn't he drop twice mm. in two minutes. Bro, he dropped quicker. He were he he dropped quicker than a than a P star blood. It was crazy. My the God. way he hit the deck, blood. I was like, "Whoa, fam! Is that Van der Ven or Mia Mia Khalifa or one of them?" Baby, what's her name? <laughs> what's, what's a new one, blood? Tiana Trump and them, blood. You get me, like Adam Twenty Two's gal and them thing. It was mad. You get me, but um, Anthony Gordon, fantastic goal as well. You get me. He 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 put my man in his batty crease as well. Um, Brentford two, Sheffield United nil. Tony, when... Tony, were even on the. Tony was on the bench, blood. And he didn't even bring him on. I was kind of shocked. What's at that. Yeah, what's going on there with that? That's I an important know. win for them. It was in a very yeah, yeah. very important win. But I think Sutter's definitely, <clears throat> definitely going on there, blood. Yeah. You get me? Because reports came out talking he's going to be available for cheap, but I don't know why. It didn't mm. say why, but it was talking yeah, fake. How true yeah. true that is, I don't know. But yeah, I'm mm. saying that. Burnley won, um, Brighton won. Burnley thought they won it when Brownhill come off the bench and got a goal. But then that keeper, blood, Jesus Christ, that, that mistake was worse than Pickford, blood. You get me? Like, the ball literally run under his feet. It was like the, do you remember the um, the Enkelman thing at Birmingham away? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that, yeah, yeah, yeah. That, yeah. it was yeah. like that, blood. It was like, raw. Yeah. can't believe he done that, blood. Man City 5, Luton 1. Um, Doku bossed it, I can't lie. Um, done his thing. Shout out Kovacic, him. annual screamer. That was a his bang. Level. Even Barbie Doe, like, Barbie Doe's cooking now, I can't lie, like, 2-2. Two and two, um, He done the keeper with the eyes, pulled it near post. Um, Ross Barkley getting his fifth goal of the season. I, I took that well. Over. Yeah, I take him over Madison. I can't lie. Madison's been playing kind of shit. Yeah, he's been poor. Since, Madison since he's come back from injury, blood. He's been, he's been playing poor. piss poor, blood. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, Forest two, Wolves two, Morgan Gibbs White and Danilo getting the goals for Forest. Cunha's first goal was a banger. Still, I can't lie. Yeah. Then he got the equaliser. Him and Morgan, him and Morgan were beefing as well. When Cunha, Morgan. when Morgan scored the first one, yeah. he went past yeah. him like that. Mm. So when Cunha scored the second equaliser, 
he done fucking my man celebration. Nah, it was it was fucking bad. Oh, man. people out people out here taking celebration. I love all that, man. We need more of that in the game. Yeah, I love the trolling. Man. Yeah, man, we need more of that in the game. It's too it's too friendly. It's yeah. too friendly. I'm telling man. West Ham nil, Fulham two. Um, man like Pereira, blood Andrew. Pereira. Let me. He let off a couple goals for Fulham. And yeah, that's it, blood. Champions League. Hamza. Big game, man. City, Real Rome. Madrid. Real Madrid comes Hamza, to the please don't turn along. It's 4.30 a.m. It's, 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 it's a big game, basically. Big game for us. Yeah, yeah, you, you asking, hey, 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 hey. <laughs> Sam, you asking the rain not to um, fall, my friend. <laughs> you can talk about Europa League, man. That's doing your level now. Champ, because people play Wednesday and Tuesdays. Wait for Thursdays. Listen, big game, man. I think I've said it before. This has become like one of the biggest games of the season. Bigger than El Clasico. Real Madrid Man City is like the big European <laughs> game now. Like, like <clears throat> if we're talking about if we're talking about like proper big game, like big dogs. These are big dogs. The two big dogs in world football to each other. Someone even said, I think Ike Casillas said is it's become the biggest rival of European football in the last couple of years. Like it used to be Chelsea Barca. This this overpasses it. Like the respect that we have for each other. The two big clubs are there, man. Like this one, I think is gonna be tight. We need a farm base to create what they did last season. We need to make sure that we're up for it. Madrid, we have to respect Madrid. Madrid and Madrid, we beat them last time. It doesn't mean I disrespect them, but listen, it's war. On Wednesday, it's war, like, literally it's war. And and City are going to come gun blazing because this is a season that our fan base are going to be. We, we're already planning. I'm hearing what City fans have already planned out for that. That game is mad. What they plan? <sighs> Bro, last season... Just more mad. than 15 people in the stadium? Bro. <laughs> last, <laughs> last season... Listen, that's what I'm saying. You you guys are laughing. That's the problem. You guys are laughing. Ask mm. Benji. Hey, Ask Hamza. Benji. All we got is jokes. What else have we got? Tell me. No, that's, that's not my <laughs> Tell me. <laughs> but yeah, you're what? making Europa League jokes. I could dream of that right now. Then, listen. Last season, we got them to do halftime talks like within 10 minutes, 15 minutes. These guys were doing halftime talks like middle of the pitch. Benzema was talking to them. Benzema went to smoke shit. Do you feel like you're going to do that again? <laughs> listen. Will you have them in that sort of position again? Pause. Listen. We'll, listen. You'll see. Wednesday, bro, it's a big game. It's, a it's not about what we see. We want to know your predictions. I lie. You believe you're going to smoke City? Do you think you're going to smoke Madrid like that? Where's your chess? Bro, I have respect Madrid. But I'm telling you about this game. Why? Because you got clipped last time when you said you're going to the final. You respect Madrid, but you tell me that you have them doing halftime team talks in the 30th minute. And you're the one that told me that Madrid Madrid fear you. And now you're at home. Where's your chest blood? I just want to know how you're feeling about the game. Yeah. Uh, Listen, I'm feeling good before the game. I'm feeling good. You don't look like you're feeling good. You look a bit nervous. No, no, I'm not nervous. Look, I'm not nervous. (laughs) What are you talking about? Your I'm face not nervous. looks nervous. Nah. Yeah, look, I'm, I'm, used to, I'm not used to you. I've I'm never sorry. seen you without an air of like confidence. I, so you can tell I, like, I'm I think I see like a little bead of sweat. Yeah, yeah. I see a man no, shit right. his No, club. no, no. Hamza, you're right to be. I agree. Even though it's I think we're you'll get through. Okay. It's, just the first, it's the first time I've ever seen you like this. So it's new to me. That's all. But Flawless, you think we're going to lose on Wednesday? No, I think you win, I said. Unfortunately, I think you win. How much? Like a 2-1 t- like or something. We because. want to know your prediction, though. Well, yeah, what's your... Like, I'm I just mean, saying, you look know. nervous. Look at you. Yeah, because like, all I'm here for is extra <laughs> time. Nervous, you're looking for extra time. There's nothing there, bro. Yeah, he's he's nervous. nervous. You're your whole life, I've predicted no game. You've never had hair, blood. <laughs> <laughs> you can't no show my one picture with you with hair, blood. <laughs> Listen, I'm not predicting no game, bro. Like, there's something there, blood. There's never been nothing there, blood. There's there, there's there, bro. You better off just grabbing your armpits or something, blood. Listen, I'm not predicting no game, man. I'm just saying, listen. Damn. Wait, 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 wait! Whoa, 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 whoa! whoa, whoa you're not whoa, predicting. Whoa, 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 no, no, no! This is the no. This is no, no! You can't sit back, man. Whoa. This is the prediction section. How can you? The how can drop. you not predict? Whoa. Your bad boy, Manchester City. Like you are you the, the triple winners, the three Peters, the champions of the world. 
treble winners, what? as you keep telling me. You what? can't tell me you're going into this you game be, without confidence. You said to me, Madrid, fear you. Mm. Huh? Huh? Hey, you listen, say that to me? Listen, no, listen. Huh? It's just a massive... It's about what? respect. It's about well, respect. Nah, what's your prediction, blood? Wait, hold uh, up. Yeah, we don't bro, this is football. Good. Respect my back foot, man. What's right. your thoughts, man? Yeah, you got Come so on. much chest when it comes to United. Like oh, it comes to now Arsenal. You got your leg with your tail between your legs. No, did he? You are mm-hmm. treble winning with Pep Guardiola. No, I'm not chicken. Yeah, I'm just football. saying. Oh, no, 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 Hamza. You call him the goat of all football. You got Kevin De Bruyne and Harlan, Harlan, and Bernardo Silva. You got Goku, bro. Remember, baby Ronaldinho. Baby Ronaldinho. Don't worry about Vinicius, blood. You got baby Dino, bro. Yeah, don't worry about Vinicius. You got talk about Rodrigo, one of the best players. They talk about Modric. Hey, 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 my friend. We just need a position. One of the we greatest just, players. We just need two numbers from you, my friend. Man, just like, two, yeah? man that's combined age is like 85, yeah. blood. Yeah, man, we just need two numbers, my friend. Hello? Yeah. Listen. A dash between yeah, both nah, of them. Nah, nah, nah. You, can't, I, 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 you cannot ever say to me about anything ever again where we're on live stream. You, just you can't run your mouth ever just, again now. You're just done. Make a prediction. I'm not even saying City. You have to say All City. When I've got a prediction. How can I give what you a prediction? All we're asking is if you believe in your team or not. Yeah. How, 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 do you how believe? I tell you, I'm more, more, how am I more confident in your team than you are? How, I how am I more shook? You don't believe that's why you think you think you're going out. You're, yeah, you think you're fucked. No chance. Okay, so so you either win or so if that means you win. Yeah, you win. Yeah, you going through. Okay, what score? We got there. Okay, what score? What's the score? I don't score, score blood. Score, what, yeah, penalties, score. extra time. What no, was ninety that? minutes. Ninety minutes. Ninety minutes. Oh, score. Hall- what? Holland score. Two nil. Two one. Huh? What? Two oh, one. We're beating them. Two one. Two one. Mm. Two one. Two one. Believe that. You don't believe that. So you don't think they're going to be in, having that same team talk they had from last season? Then. Listen. No, they're a good team. They. 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 they the reason why they're going to play different is they. they but you lot absolutely play. smoked them at the Etihad last they're time. Pack, they're going to try and pack the bus. You don't think you can do that again? And yeah, they're going to pack the bus. Time. They'll pack the bus. I'm t- pack yeah, the man, bus. they got no Benzema hazards retired. Remember, I said. still injured. Let, let me say, biggest <laughs> thing. Hey, Luis Fuckers. <laughs> <Real Madrid, laughs> I dare Real Madrid have more than 40% possession. Remember, I said. Clip this. Will Real Madrid have. More than 45, 45, I said. 45. That's more than 45. If you more than 45. Go, oh, yeah, more, more than 45. More than 45. What? They probably percent won't, possession. but that, that don't change them. They only need 30, 35 yeah, to beat you. Possession, Hamza, yeah. The biggest club. The biggest club in the they, world. They, they have, hey, they got Vinicius Jr., the best winger in the world. Your words. You don't need that much. You don't need 60% of the ball. Possession. Like, possession. The biggest club in the world, you dominate. You don't Is Rudiger going to pocket Haaland again? Not necessarily. You don't smash and grab if you're the biggest club in the world. You play why with pride. You, why do you smash and grab? Yeah, we see. We're the little city. The Champions League the finals. City. Right, what are we talking about here? You can win this win by any means necessary, my friend. Mm. Word to Malcolm X. It's Malcolm X FC. Malcolm X FC by any means necessary. What are we talking about here? Oh, you want to win looking pretty. I get it. All right, yeah, I want to yeah, yeah. play good ball. Yeah, yeah football. Man, I hear that, man. They have to. They set the standard last season. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, because they were so great against Inter Milan in the, in the Champions League final. Oh, no, not the final. Not the final. They were so great against Atletico Madrid over those two legs. Lukaku, though. Bruv. But yeah, Hamza, is Rudiger pocketing Haaland again? Listen, I don't know. I can't. Haaland's having a poor season this season. Oh, I don't know is he? <laughs> I am, compared to his level. He scored 30, 32 goals overall. He's missed two months. But he's still got 32 goals overall. That's not bad for a striker. He's missed already eight, eight or nine games. Yeah. So big up Haaland. Premier League games, I think he's missed six. Big up Haaland for having 20 league goals. And he doesn't take... Yeah, he's, he's got, got the same Paul as Cole Palmer. Palmer. Cole Palmer's got like seven penalties or eight penalties. 40% of his goals are penalties. 40 penalties. Haaland ain't taking penalties for you, man. Hey, hey, pen- penalty. Penalty. Hey, penalties, hey, penalties don't count because they're not pretty goals. So they don't count. Bro, I score penalties. Sorry, I've never missed penalty. Man. Uh, how many big chances missed does Haaland have? Because Cole Palmer's got four. Has he? Yeah, yeah. Do, do, do you know how many Haaland has? Haaland's had four in a match. Haaland has 30. Haaland has 30. <laughs> See? So, so uh, we, 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 can, we can go bar for bar, Haaland and Palmer. It doesn't mean anything. We're both sitting at the top. 
strikers often miss chances because they have all those chances. But this season is his worst season. But all I'm saying is, football is 11, man. Wednesday, and mark my words, it's war. So 2-1, yeah? Yeah. Yeah. We got Which there. Who predicts, who, who predicts here that we're losing the game? I, I was more confident in your team than you. I just want extra time. That's all I, I care said about. This, I said from the jump, yeah, you're winning the game. Troops, do we beat them? Yeah. I uh, yeah, we'll go all the way. To, yeah, that's fine. You went, you, you went to the Bernabeu and got a free free. You have to beat them at home. Yeah. If you don't, Sam, are we beating Madrid? He's just like, yo, I've had enough. Sam, I've had we enough. Beat Madrid. What happened? Are we beating Madrid? <laughs> yeah, City and Arsenal going through. I stick by it. One sec. I'm like, can't lie. I zoned out, brother. It's 4.30 a.m. and you're giving me speeches about heritage. You have one UCL, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and you're playing Europa League. This day. is the longest back again ever. We should never invite Hamza. I hate I you, Joe, honestly. I know. It was a bad idea. Yeah, it's... <laughs> nah, big up hands at all. Why, lad? But um, we travel to Bayern Munich. Fun, guys. Yeah, this Hamza, this is Hamza's... This Hamza is City Arsenal winning. That's my prediction. I don't know about winning, blood. I don't think we're going through. I think... I think on Wednesday, the season ends, blood. You get me? Wow. Um, you say the stars are not aligning troops? Nah, they're not. Unfortunately, they are not aligning. Um, I think we lose out in Germany. I think the way we lost to Villa... It's killed you. Um, I think there's stars aren't be... aligning for Arsenal then. I think there's going to be a hangover effect. E- uh, either that or a massive confidence builder. I can't see us going to Etihad and winning. We haven't gone nowhere of 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 note and won this season. You get me? Thanks. We we went to Anfield and drew. We went to Etihad and drew. We went to Stamford Bridge and drew. Oh, the... and drew. Port and lost. Sanchez. Oh yeah, you lost one nil. Yeah, the late one. Lost yeah, it was the late one. Yeah, it was the late one. I mean, right. Sevilla, Sevilla, we won out, but Sevilla ain't nothing, blood. You get me? Like, so I'm not really filled with a lot of confidence. You understand? And mm-hmm. I take a chopping and changing the lineup doesn't bring me confidence as well, blood. You get me? Because we saw that the team works without Zinchenko in the team. And Havertz works when he's not in the midfield. What do you do against Villa? You put fucking Zinchenko in, and then you fucking add um, Havertz to the midfield. So Arteta has these brain freezes like Klopp used to have when he overthinks it and then he fucks it. You get me? And I'm, I'm... I'm curious and worried to see what the starting eleven is. I think that will dictate how a lot of this um, game will go. I think the first goal as well is vital. You get me? Um, If we score first, my thought process will change. Because I think if we score first, we win. I think if they score first, they win. You get me? That I've been to Germany. I've been. You can get one goal and just sit back and you can back your defence enough to do that. You feel me? And we've done that at the Etihad. So, you understand? We know that they're not... They ain't got the same threat as City, but the forward line is still dangerous, blood. You get me? And they got pace, and we know it's the pace that hit us. So we and They've been prepping for this match the last few weeks because Tuchel already gave up Bundesliga. This is their all or nothing, blood. This is their biggest game. They never had no fans in the first leg. They're going to have fans in this game. I've been to the Allianz Arena. Their fans don't play blood. You understand? They got this thing behind the goal where they just go like the whole game blood. You understand? But it's not even just there. It's the, it's the whole stadium. They go. Yeah. You understand? German Especially... atmospheres are brazy. Yes. Yeah, it's, it's one of the best in, in Europe. So I hear it. And when we've, gone to, that, them, when we've gone to them kind of atmospheres in Europe, them, them heated atmospheres, we've fell on our face, blood. You get yep. me? We went to Lawns. France is very heated and we lost 2-1. We went to Porto and lost. You get me? Sevilla's not heated like that, innit? So we went there and done our thing. PSV, we was already through on top. We drew 1-1. But PSV also were through. So there was really 
nothing on the it's game, you get me? So the crowd wasn't how they would normally be because even the Dutch places, they're more they're, they're on it as well, blood. So for for them reasons is why I'm 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 more thinking that we lose this game, blood. You get me? Yeah. I hear you. Yes, I, I hear it. Yeah, I agree. I, I had you lot going through, obviously, like I said, before the first leg. But after the first leg, we needed a two-goal lead. the bag. Yeah, you needed minimum We needed a two-goal lead. lead. Fumbled the bag because everything was going, everything, like I've said before, was in your favour going into that game outside of the Champions League heritage and players who have actually won it. You lot fumbled. You lot fumbled. You'll go out. You'll go out. I think even if you score the first goal there, like, I think you'll still go out. I don't see I that. think if we score the first, we go through. Yeah, that's where we disagree. I think you go out regardless. I think they'll turn it around because the, the crowd will turn up and they'll turn up. It just depends on how much you back the defence at the end of it. If if Zinchenko plays, we're finished. Zinchenko going to play? You going you gonna to play at some he point? He has to play Tommy Asu. Like, Kiwio can't play because Sane put him in a spliff, a bong, a urn, a coffin, the oven, air fryer, toaster, <laughs> microwave, fridge, freezer. Washing machine, bathtub, no diddy, everywhere, blood. You get me? It was mad. So, Kiwio can't start that game. Tomiyasu has to start, blood. You understand? When he fucking put on Tomiyasu against Villa, I thought, yes, he's big enough Zinchenko. He fucking took off Ben White. I was in utter shock, blood. Like, utter shock, bro. You get me? So... I don't want to see that politician anywhere near the starting eleven. He done all right though against Bayern Munich coming off the bench. He brought us back into the game, but away from home, that's where that's where he hurts us, blood. You get me? We've seen away from home two times at Anfield. He has cost us blood. You get me? So he don't have it in him to play in the side away from home. He's more of a home player. You get me? <clears throat> kind of like Ozil, where Ozil couldn't perform away from home in a big game, but at home he would have the time of his life. Blood, Odegaard's kind of coming away from that tag, as to say, because he's going away and doing his thing. Blood, you get me. The team might not be performing, but he's doing. Martin he's Odegaard doing is performing. Blood, you get me. He is performing at a level, and he is showing why he's our captain. Blood, you get me. But yeah, like I said, the first goal is vital. I don't want to see Jesus start as well, blood. You get me? Um, if, Saka's, on top. if Saka's fit enough, Saka has to start. Um, it, I'd go Saka, Havertz in the nine, and Trossard. Okay. That's how I'd go, you get me? First? I'd start Partey as well. Partey, Rice, Odegaard. Yep. Got you. you get me? And yeah, then yeah, the back yeah. four, Ben White, Saliba, Gabriel, Tommy Asu. Mm -hmm. Davere and Goldblood, you get me. I think if you pick that team, they score first, we win 2 0. Because I think we can defend and then late on, nick a goal. You get me, maybe from a set piece. We're dangerous from set pieces. But if they score first, yeah, it's peak, fam. So if we score first, 2 1 Arsenal. If they score first, 3 1 Bayern. First? First, I hear that. It all really depends on if you bag that first goal because if you don't, it's going to start just going back and forth. I'm going, I think Bayern go through. I'm just debating whether it's 2 0 or 2 1. I'm going 3 1 Bayern. Because it is dependent on the team. I'll go, I'm going to go 2 0 Bayern. <clears throat> you saw? I think. Yeah, so I, 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 think, I think I predicted Bayern is going to draw and win this away. PSG. Well, Barca PSG predictions. Yeah, PSG. Barca, Barca winning. winning. Yeah, Barca I, I, winning 3 2. 3 2. Yeah, I watched the game. Yeah, Dembappe was on. I'm back in Dembappe. He's got to stand up. King Kelly in your time. Two. Barca three. Go on, go on, troops. Barca 3 1. Barca 2-1, I think they ball it. Well, I'm not ball it, but they go out again. I'm going PSG 2-1. 2-0, sorry. Barca win 3-1.
برشلونة أتلتيكو سيتي أرسنال فاز يوروبا ليج وسام اوكي جايز تو كيب ذس كويك ليفربول جوينج اوت ويست هام جوينج اوت ثانك يو جايز سو ماتش فور واتشينج تروبس تي في ميك شور جايز ار لايكينج ميك شور جايز ار سبسكرايبينج وير بوث اوت يو جيت مي فاك اول ذس ريمونتادا كلاب يلا ميك شور جايز ار لايكينج ميك شور جايز ار سبسكرايبينج سبسكرايب يو دونت ثينك ذيرز ا تشانس يس اند ذيرز ا تشانس اوف مي بينج ويذ ريانا ايسا بروكي غانا بريك اب وذ هير يو جيت مي اند ايم غانا سلايد ان اي ويل ميك انستغرام ناو تو دي ام يا مان دي ام ذا ويس يو كان ساي ايه مان ذا ويس ذا ويس يو كان دو از اغنور يو ار سايين نو شو يور شوت نو ذا ويست اي كان دو از ساي يور لوكينج 16 اوت اوف 10 سبان يا سبان يو نو وات اي ويل نوت ساي ذات وي ار تراين تو ذات وات از لونج از يو دونت ساي ذات يو هاف ات يو هاف ات ات ليست ا تشانس يو نو واي لويس از شيبلز ذات كويستشن He just saw me miss seven guilt edge opportunities versus fucking Palace <laughs> at home. He thinks I'm gonna go Bergamo. All these guys eating pizza and pasta in the morning and shit. I'm gonna go beat them by four goals. Okay, let's. You please, never know. Nunes me. might find a shooting boots. Yeah, like a cheeky yeah. little hat trick. Yeah, and I might find a six pack when I wake up tomorrow. Let's go. We got Todo. He says just ponder on this Nunes. Diaz and Gappa will have a legacy of goal misses, not goal scored. <clears throat> Mad. We got Johnson pause. He says, how do we fit Palmer in the England lineup, boys? That's a good question. You have to, uh, He has to play. Wait, that's like Jordan, that's, though. That's Southgate. That's Southgate's thing. That's, South, that's on Southgate. Yeah, you gotta figure that out. You but... can't, you can't, you can't not play Palmer with the seasons he's had. Same guy that season. can't play the best right back in the world. Just give up, man. Yeah, yeah, he's yeah. You can't, like, but we're talking. Yeah, we're talking outside. It's like you. Flawless cannot... Henderson is still in the England squad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because it's Southgate, but we're talking ha- like from a sensible, logical. You can't have the season Palmer's had and not play him. You can't not play Palmer. Okay. But big up Steve. Big up Steve. Big up Steve. Every time oh, he subscribed to the bro, he says, "Yo, yo, what's up, guys?" Come on, man. Big we got Steve. Queens Cove. He says, if City is a big dog, then Michelle Oba. Oh, God. Okay, man. We've been mad. We We've got Strasbourg mad. Steve one more time. Says, I got 2 2 Real Madrid advance on penalties. Hope you're right, man. That, yeah. I hope. Please. I need you that. You say, Steve, you, you smile with these things because you met, you clock, you smoke well, so about Atlanta it. Atlanta thing, innit? For content, we're having two English teams. Better for, got- better for what? For content, what that Liverpool? I mean, not Liverpool, Arsenal and City in the Champions League semi final. Yeah, more content. Should you think I give a fuck about the content? What? I need you to out <laughs> expeditiously. <laughs> I don't even want you in Europe. I don't even want you like in the Premier League. What are we talking about? Sun, I just think Arsenal get knocked out. I'd, any, I'd, I'd relegate, so I'd relegate you, man, to do you know what I'm saying to the Conference League, North Vanarama. What are we talking Sun, about? Never. Okay, now I'm with you. Now I'm with crazy. you. Big up Andy Q. He says, pumped up for tomorrow. No, did he? Show Barca respect your bum panel. Our ground will be a war zone. My cousin is a City fan, but this Champions League is mine. Acknowledge me, troops. I'm like, when you get, when Barca get kick out, yeah? When Barca get kick out, yeah? Make sure you pull up Andy, yeah? Yeah, I was going to say, aren't we the only two who pick PSG? Didn't everyone else pick Barca to go through? I pick Barca. Oh, you pick Barca? Yeah, I got PSG. Was he saying respect Barca? I'm the only one who's had... I got PSG going through. I'm the only That's one. That's what I'm saying. Respect. Yeah. Big up Andy Q one more time. He says, number six is coming to me. Barca four. PSG nil, Ross. All right. Barca we're, we're, not winning UCL. Yeah. We'll, we'll remember that, blood. Big up Fats one more time. He says, we love Tuchel. We love Bugle. Chelsea won the Champions League. What a chant. Tuchel, we are all behind you. Big up Super Tommy T. Come back. Big up Surafel, my G. He says, only expectation for Arsenal. Don't get thrashed. They won't, they won't be done of that, bro. That's one thing I'll say. Big up Terrence. He says, time to fight PTSD. Looks bleak, but come on, you gunners. It's time to face Group the real demons. He's ready to fight the demons. Yeah, man. It's time, to, it's time to face the real demons, blood. The aliens arena. Big up yeah, Surafel he's... one more time. Big up the pod. Favorite NBA teams. I'm a neutral, just have favorite players. I was I'm in New York, so I was Don't in New York, me. so I like the Knicks. Yeah, Knicks I, 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 I yeah, don't Knicks have a team. I've watched like two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This year they just they finished uh, second. 
in the, in the oh, shit. Yeah, yeah, they did well this year. We still got Randall, yeah. Now it's um, is Randall still there? The um, Brunson, he's the star player. I ain't oh, gonna lie, man. I don't watch the East like that, so I have no idea. I don't watch oh, the man. Eastern. No one watches the East, brother. <laughs> yeah, I don't watch the East. Big up Corey. He says this club is why I bun weed. Actually, can't be us. I'm with you, broski. Trust me. Yeah, Big up the Queen City Red one more time. She says he has to play. You know mm. damn well. Deep down, Southgate will only bring Palmer off the bench for a few minutes. Low. Hey, if it keeps him from injuries, go for it, man. Go for it. I'm selfish when it comes to this. Big up Mithun. He says, choose bear love from Toronto. Come through, my G. You're, um, Hussam. Yeah. Big up Mithun. Big up Todor. He says, we need some... Gandalf, Gandalf music for fuck's sake. I don't even know what that is, blood. Fortunately, this ain't Harry Potter, this real life. Oh, is that Harry Potter? Yeah, ain't no Wingardium Leviosa. See, I don't even know, blood. Oh, shit, wait, wait, before we go, wait, no super chat from God underscore AEM. You've been telling me all season long how Liverpool are going to win the league, and I ain't seen him since, since, since Saturday, and he's not here. Crazy. Yeah, you see, you see, you only sing when you win and done the jokers, you know. You know, a hella chat. We here regardless. We got win, lose, or draw. Or in my case, lose, draw, or lose. I'm here. You know, but you like want to disappear when you lose one game to... All right, bet. Ain't seen you. Actually, Atalanta, so we ain't seen you since then. Hmm. God underscore AEM, man. If anyone sees him, tell him I said big he's up. One of the guys and I hope he's good. Test, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's been on my... All season long. Salute to him. All season long. He's been in my <clears> chat. All oh, are we going to win the league. You don't know what you're talking about, or right, right, right. Now look, it's space of four or five days. When this waiting four days, where y'all at? Where to Drake? But all right, cool. Big up Steve. He says I got us beating Arsenal 2 0 on Wednesday. Is Steve a Bayern fan? Oh yeah, he is, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Steve supports like 70 clubs. Yeah, you got you got a team in every major European country. Yeah, the Yanks are different. Well, where. where's he from in America? Uh, that's a quick question. I forgot. Uh, he, he told, told me, me this a few days yeah, I forgot. ago. Yeah, I actually forgot where he's from stateside. He sounds like East Coast. Yo, where is it? Uh, let us know in the chat, bro. Yeah, he know. told me this as well. I talk to this guy every day and I forgot. Can we do the Steve investigation like after the stream, please? <laughs> 5 a.m. <laughs> <laughs> the longest fucking show ever. Hey, you got, get, hey, 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 get used to it if you're going to be watching playoffs and stuff. This is going to be... New Hampshire. Yeah, that's see, it. East Coast, yeah. told you. That's East Coast, see? Told when you. I'm watching, I can, I can tell. watching playoffs, I'm on my bed. No one sees what I'm wearing. The AC is on. No one gives a fuck about this fucking light in my face. It's different, flawless, you fraud. <laughs> I know, Chicago. Ooh, ooh, check, you, check you with AC. You know what I'm saying? In there. All right. TJ out here, fucking Steve's agent. <laughs> that's on the Midwest. So that's by living New Hampshire. Mm. Okay. Fairs. So Chicago's like central, no? Nah, like that's central. Mid nah, that's Midwest. Okay. Big up. Far Zan says, Troops, love your work. Big up to the panel. The homies take the pain away from the disaster class this weekend. We move. Love from Toronto. Come on, you gunners. But let's not get carried away. Big up your damn self, my brother, blood. You understand? I believe that is all of the Super Chats, blood. Free hour stream, blood. Mad thing, blood. Whenever I make Hamza pull up, blood, it always gets extended. No diddy. But we are finally at the end, blood. You understand? We got everybody and their mother. We got the Super Chatters. It was actually you the end. Yo, you look, I'm going live after this, people. Today, I'm still, blood. I'm still going me? live after this. And... You understand? I appreciate you lot, blood. You get me? You keep the team going, blood. So, big up your damn selves every time. Big up the mods, them. You get me? You lot know the vibes, blood. You understand? We'll be back tomorrow for, um, what is it? PSG Barca, or should I say Barca PSG? 7.45. Make sure you're here with the kid. You don't know. Foolish is going live now. Um, redirect settings, blood. So, don't go anywhere. Subscribe to all of the man them. I'm going to put Hamza's link in the description as well. Um, yeah, so you understand? i see you lot tomorrow, but mainly and most importantly, blood.
please, please, please pray for Arsenal, blood. Potch out. Potch out.